So, if we all remember last week, yes, there is a game update, but I am too scared to active uh, to turn it on right now. Okay. So, last week was a, was a horrible, horrible nightmare where everything went wrong for me, and then we tried safe scrubbing the game because it was a jerk, and we lost we lost almost our entire fleet to enemy Hello subs there. and mines. Um. I tried to surrender, and the government wouldn't let me, and then once I finally started, I was up like 14 or 15 thousand victory points on the French, and then my government collapsed, and we lost, and I tried to save scrub, and it put me back like three years or something like that, and I went, fuck it, we're done for the day. And then, we and love then, you. Shut up, baby, I know it. Hey, we got uh, Fred. Fred Jr. Sr. Thanks for the diddly. Um, I, I replayed the French War off screen. And I won in about 18 months. Um, as you can see, I lost all of my, my ships in, in oh, I think, all, yeah, because the uh, the French, after my government collapsed, the French took what was left. Um, but I have, I believe I've lost one biggie. Yeah, I lost Comrade Apple in this war, but that's it. The, se the second time around trying to play the war off screen, everything was perfectly fine. Everything was perfectly fine. That I uh, try again without subs off screen. Yes, I played it for a couple years and it seems to have worked. Um, so far, in, in the second time around through this French war, I lost one heavy cruiser to a sub and that's it. Everything else is fine. Um, the entire Comrade Zate um, class of uh, uh, battle cruisers is up and running. They got 12 12 inch guns and four triple turrets. Uh, and are rated for 29 knots, which is real fast. We've still got the two comrade apples. You. Shut up, baby, I know it. Big Bob, thanks Glorious for Diddly. Soviet hat. Ah, thank you. We've got the two comrade airs, or their comrade apple class, the comrade air and the uh, LMH6. Um, they've got eight 15 inch guns, and then we've got the older crags. Alexander class? Alexander class, which. Probably we'll just get refit. Uh, that might be a good idea. We, we that might be something we could do with um, our balance right now because basically we're not building anything other than a handful of destroyers. So why don't we try to see if we can't? Um, we've got Crag and the Glav Tar Tar Tar. Still good ships, twenty five thousand tons. Um, good good weapons. We might be able to rebuild them to be like ancillary battle cruisers. Oh yeah, for some reason, Alberto, you're right. When I play on Tuesdays, things go well for me. When I play on Wednesdays, this game tells me to go go screw. Uh, so we're gonna open the design for a rebuild and see what we can't do with these bad boys. So their turrets are still good. They've got um, quality one 12 inch guns. If I replace the machinery, that'll give me several hundred extra tons. Will I be able to get another knot out of it? I, w I, I could up her speed. But there's not much else we can do with this ship. Uh, I don't think I'm allowed to... Well, what if we... Can, are we allowed to do this? Can we put those in turrets? Ooh, we can. We can reduce... We, we, we could take uh, the 6-inch secondary battery off. We're not swear anymore. You should be fine to swear. I swear all the time. Fuck! Okay, yeah, that's the problem. That that program fucks up the um, the uh, the mic. So yeah, there we go. I can see my voice dancing on the waveforms. I think. Hmm. All right. So right now we've got. Uh, let's reduce these to ten and ten. And that'll allow us to throw on some AA guns. We don't have AA directors yet. But we can we can start outfitting these bad boys with AA guns for certain. Can we get this back? Okay, not bad. So, um, we've altered the secondary and the tertiary armament. And we've installed AA guns. Uh, also, we've upped her speed. I mean, it's gonna be it's it's two thirds of the cost of making a new one, but it's only gonna take a year. Uh, 
Um, I think that's it for the rebuild on these bad boys. Also give them a little bit more speed. The, the more speed is what I'm most interested in. Can I get this back? No. Can I get more of these bad boys? No. Oh, and we're actually over there. No way. It's going to be, yeah, I was going to say, we're going to be off by a lot. I think we're just going to have to save that weightage there. Um, go ahead, save that. Rebuild her for the 1925 pattern. Two of these. That'll keep them good to go for a while. Now, uh, we've got two classes of light cruisers. So the Albertskis are the newer ones, it looks like. And the Miscellaneous are the older ones, which are very similar. They're very similar. Very, very similar. And what about our... Oh. The heavy cruisers are old. Do we have any... Do we have any current designs for uh, destroyers? Battleships. Battle cruisers, destroyers. The Melee class. What is the Melee class? I don't know what that is. It's not valid, is what it is. So we're probably not going to use it. It's probably why. Um. Well, why did the? Huh. These were rebuilt. These were built in 1915, rebuilt in 1917, which probably means they just got updated directors. All right, let's take a look at these bad boys. Let's see what we can't do. Very, we, we save a lot of weight on replacing the machinery. Again, it's expensive, but it's cheaper than building new ones. We do not have better quality guns. Rebuilding the turrets probably won't be any good. 10 inches or smaller in singles or 6 inches or smaller in triples. I think we'll just stick with the uh, the 6, 8 inch guns. We can upgrade the quality. Wait, did these? Uh, for a second there, I thought those buttons worked. We can uh, increase the quality of the secondary battery. And if we put these in single turrets, we can make this a dual purpose uh, anti-aircraft battery. Okay, okay. Subs have been banned. I think what we'll do is, because I, I don't want to modify the files at mid-game, I think what we'll do is the next time we play uh, with the 1.07 patch, probably unless 1.08 comes out by the time we start a new game, what we'll probably do is turn subs off <laughs> before we get into it. And um, oh, so another knot is a lot of weight. But what else are we going to do with the weight? So let's take a look around. There's not much else to do. Leave that on normal. All right. Well, uh, we'll give her. I don't think these guys can have those. We'll give her a suite of anti-aircraft guns. There we go. We turn off subs. Subs are incredibly unentertaining in this game. You don't design them. You don't deploy them. You, you, you don't uh, fight with them. They're just they're just like this amorphous modifier to the game. And, you know, like when I was playing last week, I lost almost my entire fleet to enemy submarines. It's like all my ship, because you can't directly control them, my ships would just sail out and then they would all get torpedoed and, and never make it back. One of, one of my battle cruisers was deployed and torpedoed like the next month and sank. It's just, ugh. Losing like 300,000 tons in ships to store to, to, to submarines uh, was really frustrating. They're just, to me, they're not entertaining to play with. Because you don't actually do anything with them yourself. They're just boring. All right. Um, I might be able to get that knot out. I can. 28 knots. So we upgraded the secondary battery, the tertiary battery, the AA guns, the engines.
Changing the armor actually costs a fair bit. You can give her a couple more rounds in those uh, those guns there. I think that's good. Oh, and director is still the best, so yeah. Okay, save. Not all luck might model 1925 pattern. Oh, and I set them both to go at the same time, which I actually didn't mean to do, but uh, though that is rebuilding four of our largest ships, which will all be done in a year. Why does the game look like it's from Windows 7? Well, I was going to say Windows XP, but sure, Windows 7. Make me feel old. Proved to depth charges. Burst at revolutionary zeal, the MIG Comp Design Bureau has developed a float plane on their own initiative. Uh, let's see. It is worse than the current one. It just has a larger bomb uh, bob load, which um, I'm actually gonna not going to take. Well, those destroyers finishing might actually help out the uh, the budget imbalance I have going. We might not, not, not have to do much. Oh, um, foreign station, foreign station. Everything's basically on reserve right now. I honestly don't know what that little asterisk means. So I'll just, uh, I'll just let it slide. Machinery development. Ooh, 1% weight saving on machinery. When you're talking about thousands of tons of machinery, it adds up. New Japanese light carrier, the Ryujo. Oh, look at that bad boy. It's a designate it's a it's a dedicated light carrier. It's not bad, really. Sound effects don't work, they should work. Uh Your mother's a bitch. Hello there. Should probably make some of those on our own. U.S. is fun to play. U.S. has like the lar. Woo! Better quality six-inch guns. Right after I ripped them off my battle cruisers. Um, the U.S. has a lot of money to work around with. <laughs> Fascist coup is taking place in Japan just in time. One of our agents has been caught in France. Make it a hero. The Nakajima Zero is in. Uh, ooh, we could probably take these guys out of here. Uh, let's put a little bit more in Japan, see what they're up to. British government is offering to sell us the rights to efficient hull forms. Yes. Reduces engine HP requirements. Delightful. And we are oh, we almost got our bu budget balanced. Almost. As soon as that last destroyer bips off. Yeah. Uh, let's see. The Lavochkin uh, Design Bureau has developed a medium bomber, which we don't have yet, so I will take it. Major arm firm wants to sell ships to a South American country. Of course. And uh, heavy, he improved heavy AA effectiveness, which I don't think I even have heavy AA guns yet. But okay. Um, in terms of destroyers, we made a bit of a jump up from this, uh, from the, the MiG-2 to the Brody. We went from 700 tons to 1,200 tons. But uh, these guys aren't aren't you know awful just yet. Oh wait, you know what? We got a Mick one left. Let's go ahead and scrap that last bad boy there. Uh, holy crap! And I forgot the hull from our light carrier was laid down in 1899. We should design our light uh, some light carriers. You want to see your ship? Uh, yeah. As soon as it's off the um off the slipways, it's getting rebuilt right now. It'll be done in a few months. I got $28 for that ship. Torpedo bomber. Whoa, we don't have those. The Aleutian IO-21. Heavy bomb load of 2,000 pound bomb. Oh my. New French heavy cruiser. Eight nine inch guns. The French don't have a super firing B turret yet on their cruisers, but neither do I, so shut up, Magnus. Uh, a lot less armor than mine.
lot less armor. Yay! Improved industrialization. Kirov and the nautical fuck and the crag have all finished. Looks like maybe one of them was late. New British bomber, the short gannet. There are uh, medium bombers in service now, which we I don't think we've actually set up anywhere. Where it's a heavy cruiser, nautical lock, Kirov, Kopchalov, Glavtar Tartar. Well, this is uh, the same. You know, should be one more month. Yeah, Glavtar Tartar. Government wants to reduce naval spending. Yeah, protest the hell out of that. Secondary directors enables directors for secondary batteries and for light cruisers. That means we're laying down a, night, a new light cruiser, probably. Here she blows. She just got a rebuild. She's got eight quality one 12 inch guns, 10 5 inch guns, 12 3 inch dual purpose guns, and she just got her uh, her guts uh, gooped out and replaced, so she's a little bit faster, rated to 25 knots, and she got a suite of anti aircraft armament. Uh, the, the extra two knots I'm getting out of the new engines, I'm, I'm rather happy with. So that reminds me. No anti-aircraft guns on these guys. And these ones are pretty light, too. These bad boys might need some... Nope, uh, nope, nope. Nope, we're doing things. We're designing a new light cruiser. Do I even have above-water diddlies? No, I don't! Take those off. Shoot. I don't have above water doodlies. That's that's bad, but uh, we do have director firing on these now, so we'll go ahead and do that. I don't believe I have super firing forward turrets. Is that legal? It is. Uh, if anything, we want these these to have like long or extreme range. Do we have diesel engines? Normal. It's only set up to 3,700 tons. I do not have diesel engines. So we'll just have to stick with medium range for now. What do you miss? Not much. I rebuilt two battleships and um, two heavy cruisers. And now we are laying down a new light cruiser. Alrighty, let's take a look around. Um, we're gonna. I'm going to go up to... Let's... Let's stay, let, let's say 5,000 tons and work from there. I usually like to have a two inch belt on my cruisers because that means that they're not going to get um, perforated by shrapnel. All right, and three inch guns. We are obviously going to put in a bunch of these because what I can do is dual purpose them and they could serve as uh, a heavy anti aircraft armament. And then what we'll do is we'll take off a bunch of these. Let's leave four of them on. Four and four. There we go. Hey, Ben. Uh, I know it was during the beginning of this campaign, but how did the Beatman class do? I'll have to look, because I honestly don't remember off the, off the top of my head. I'll have to take a look as soon as we're done here uh, designing this ship. Um, I do want way more ammunition in here. Let's crank that up to 200. Okay. Can I get that knot back? You know what we could probably do with that weight? Ah, yeah, to get the engine priority away from speed and put it on normal. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, here, let's, um, let's take one of those off and add on a couple more light anti-aircraft weapons. Can I get... Do I have enough... For, um, there we go. There we go. I, I generally keep my light cruisers fairly small. Six-inch quality guns of, of quality one. Yes, I do, but uh, that's going to mean a significant improve uh, increase in weight. The weight of the turrets will go up a lot. The weight of the ammunition will go up a lot. The rate of fire will go down. On my light cruisers, I honestly uh, like five-inch guns. So that is that's like perfect. Okay, so let's see if I remember where this is. Let's let's pick a name for this new class of light cruiser. The Delory. 
the Delory. All is well. Save that design. Cannot be overwritten. Okay. Do we already? I don't. I don't. I know there's not any in class in the class right uh, in in service right now. So the Delory two. Uh, Beepman class. Doesn't look like they fared too well. Oh, they got... Those are the ones that got absolutely trounced in the war with the British. Um, one of them burned down to Rakeel. And the other two, I think, were either sunk... Yeah, were sunk directly by gunfire. They didn't do too well. Hmm. Latest Dreadnought? Um, th this is my, my newest ship that would be classified as a battleship. And they're they're honestly a couple years old at this point. Uh, eight 15-inch guns, 14-inch belt, uh, only 22 knots. They're honestly rather slow. How do you turn off submarines? You have to edit the game files. But this is my newest battleship. My newest heavy ship is this one. These are my new battle cruisers, which were uh, several years newer. 12 quality one 12-inch guns. Uh, only an 11 inch belt, but they do have anti-aircraft guns because planes were a thing when they were laid down and they are capable of 29 knots. Uh, and I'll actually let this sit for a bit. It, Agent, uh, Agent has been caught in Great Britain. Make him a hero. Get a little bit of wiggle room in there and let's build another dock. Let's up that. 34,000 tons is pretty small. Oil has been discovered in Australia. One of our major arms manufacturers wants to enter a tech sharing agreement with Germany. Sure. Glory 2. Okay, I'm going to lay down four of these. They're actually pretty cheap. And in theory, in theory, I should be able to build a light carrier. A dedicated light carrier. Uh, nominal 10,000 tons. It's got four inch guns. Honestly, if we do this, we'd have, uh, we could, we could, we could dual purpose them. They could uh, serve as anti-aircraft guns. And then we could just get rid of these ones. And need a secondary battery if you got a primary. That, that does the, <laughs> that does the trick. All right, uh, and it's got a aircraft capacity of 23, not very high. Yes, Alberto is the one who knows how to do the getting rid of the submarines thing. Delete the tech under the submarines. Yep. Catapults yet? I don't believe so. Hey, Wolf King. Um... I might, you know what? What if we went up to maybe 12,000 tons? How many more planes can we get in there? Quite a few, actually. I'm a little... I'm okay with 30. Yeah, I'm, I'm dropping some frames. Um, guys, I'm going to... I'm going to restart my stream really quick. Um, I was having tr trouble at the top of this, and I'm having... And it's, I can tell right now, it's still dropping frames every once in a while. Um, I'm going to restart the stream. It'll just take me two minutes... Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. All right. So let's, um, we'll come back to that. Save this. I'll be right back. Get that back. Okay. We're back. We're back, guys. We're back. Uh, not dropping any frames this time. CPU usage is normal. Got my music. Got my audio. I think we're okay. All right. We were designing a light carrier. Light... Aircraft carrier. Boom. Uh, I think, if I remember correctly, we went up to, what, 12,000 tons? And we decreased this. And we got rid of these. Dual purpose. Fire control positions. Let's give them three as tradition. I believe we got up to 30, right? Yes, there we go. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. That's basically what we wanted. It's got no armor, so uh, let's hope it doesn't get a hit. 
Fill out its uh, anti-aircraft armament, I guess. Perfect. All okay. Alrighty, already. Someone gets to be named, uh, gets our first dedicated aircraft carrier. Well, I just picked two names by accident, so that means I gotta lay down two, doesn't it? Oh, you know what? Chatbot's not on because I restarted my computer. So that, that didn't do anything because the bot's not on. Let the bot turn on. Once the bot's on and I turn the queue on, then, then it'll work. Hog of old car ships, jolly cars are our men. We always are ready, steady boys, steady. We'll fight and we'll conquer again and again. Alrighty, all's well. Uh, okay. Now we'll try this. That's the wrong button. Takes a sec. Hey, there we go. It's the Maze Men class. There we are, beautiful. Tight US Rebellion broke out in Midway. Now, ooh, that was nice. 4,000 extra ducats a year. New torpedo bombers ready for service. Rebellion in Midway continues. Government will want to sell us rights to hull construction. Yes, I will take it. Unexpected advances in subs. Uh, new improved uh, LA-13. Higher cruise speed. Slightly faster. It's got a bigger gun. I'll take it. Build screen. We're going to build two of these. And we need a name for the second one. How many torpedo planes on the new carrier? We'll probably put a dozen on there. This is the mightiest waffle. The mighty waffle. There we are. Beautiful. We still got a little bit of wiggle room in the budget, too. Probably let that build up for a little. Oh, um, something else we need to do. So these guys only have fighters on them because we didn't know what any other kind of planes were at the time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace half of these with torpedo bombers. Maybe it takes some time. Uh, fighters and flying boats, fighters and flying boats, fighters and flying boats. That's fine. Midway's defeated the U.S. forces. Midway is now declared independence. The seven people who work who work there. Ah, oh, god damn it! Above water torpedo tubes for light cruisers. I just—they're not even. I just laid those down several months ago. Uh, lower risk la of landing accidents for my carriers. This is fine. Uh, what, what about what about you, the Kopchalov here? You don't have any anti-aircraft uh, diddles either. You might need a rebuild. Open design for rebuild. Last in her class left. Although it's got to be pretty expensive. It's not, I mean, she's pretty. There's not much I can improve on her. She's pretty good. I think I think it'd probably be best to maybe design a new ship rather than build a. Uh, to then to rebuild that single one. So it's a slightly newer ship, so it's it's less. It needs a, a rebuild, not uh, 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 less. You know, you know, it's. I can't word. There's less things to to do to rebuild it. There we go. You're asking we love you. which nation sure, baby, you, uh, most likely to end in future war. last month, I figured I should use the prime. Thanks very much, nobody's hero. Appreciate that. Uh, no doubt, um, Germany or Great Britain, the British are twats. Yeah. Now what are you going to do about it? Eh. Um, hmm. maybe I shouldn't poke them. 
Good afternoon, ready to destroy the nation. Hopefully, during a coordination review, there has been a collision between one of our ships and one from Austria-Hungary. It's definitely Austria-Hungary's fault. I want a little bit more room to wiggle with. Uh, superimposed guns on destroyers. Interesting, I will take that. Ooh. Okay, so... Nautical fuck! Thanks for the resub! Uh, I just laid down a class of light cruisers. Six months into construction, they're obsolete. Because now I can do dual perp- I can, I can do, uh, dual gun mounts on cruisers, and I have above water torpedo tubes. Improved 15-inch guns! Well. That changes things. I was looking for a reason to rebuild these. Holy motherfucker! Just making the tertiary guns dual pur purpose really, uh, caused some craziness. It's fine. I have money. Big ships. Big ships. Real expensive. Can get another knot out of her. Maybe, maybe put this into, into I, I mean, she doesn't even have any anti-aircraft guns yet, so that makes me nervous. Go for a dozen dual-purpose tertiary guns. Director firing on the secondary battery. Perfect. Well, I mean, one of the we're ripping the turrets apart and putting them back together. The qual the increased quality 15-inch guns far superior. Far superior. And we're giving giving them a an actual anti-aircraft battery. Oh, it's expensive. Okay, this is fine. Save that. Yes. Eh, that's expensive. I can I almost have enough money to finish it without any without any problems though. I might have to slow stop one briefly. Hey Eliminator. That had to it's a little warm today. Uh no, I'm not gonna buy things submarine stuff. I hate subs. German government is offering to sell me anti submarine technology. Yeah, I, that I will buy. New docks complete. U.S. government is offering to sell us improved homogenous armor. Yes. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to stop one for a little while. Uh, wait, a new German pre-dreadnought? What? What are the Germans doing? Uh, the joint command is working. I think the, um, the queue is full. I think the queue is full. I'm not sure why this is still in service. I mean, it, there's no... 14,000 tons would be a kick-ass heavy cruiser. But a kick-ass heavy cruiser would, re would shred this to bits. Ooh, triple bottoms. New government wants to reduce naval spending. Nope. No reduction. In fact, in increase it. Agents have been caught in Germany. Make them a hero. With the threat from Great Britain rising, the Hawk Party managed to pass a bill authorizing additional funds. New Austrian light cruiser. Six aircraft. Six. Six aircraft. Uh, we got a new torpedo bomber design. It's faster. Its range is way higher. It's, it's not as tough, but its range is far superior. I'm gonna take it. 
And we got an improved medium bomber. Uh, looks like it's got improved range. Take that one too. Colonial crisis with Austria-Hungary has arisen. You are asked for recommendations. If it leads to war, so be it. Nope, not quite, but it improved our budget situation. And these guys are going to be done in three months, thank God. Lengthen torpedoes. You always want to have a very long torpedo. Increased endurance. Close to mastering superimposed turrets on cruisers. Improved torpedo bomber again. Um, with in it, again an increased range. I'll take that as well, and slightly tougher. Expresses concerns that our forces in Northern Europe are insufficient considering the threat from Germany. Sudden slump in the economy has led to widespread unemployment and poverty. Social reforms. Yeah, mm. We'll just do a relief for the poor. What is this going to cost me, though, is the problem. And again, a new, an improved um, torpedo bomber. Oh, there's a thousand ducats. It's not much. Okay, come on. Monthly balance funds. Okay, we're going to be okay. Aircraft carrier conversion. No, thanks. Improved quality four-inch guns. Nice. There we go. All right. So all of our major ships have been rebuilt. Nice. Unsung! Hey, buddy! Eight months Admiral Ben Wu. Woo! Alright, not bad, not bad, not bad. Um, when- I think it might be time to, uh, to ditch this bad boy, though, unfortunately. Because we've got two new light carriers coming. I'll probably replace this one with those two. And I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let, let my uh, my money build up just a little bit before we do anything else. Because everybody wants to sell me stuff. Torpedoes do more damage. New torpedo bombers enter service. Yay. Their coordination review, there's been a collision. It's Japan's fault. Definitely Japan's fault. Interesting. Austria, Hungary, and Great Britain signed a treaty to contain Russian aggression. This is fine. Superimposed turrets on cruisers. Can you be turned into a carrier? Nautical uh, luck? No. You just got... Re you. I just spent a small fortune rebuilding you? You're staying a heavy cruiser. And there's no point in rebuilding you into a, into a carrier when I can build dedicated carriers. All right, there's a couple of those bad boys. World cruise for our young cadets is planned. Send out the new bad boys. Inclined belts, nice. Uh, I, we're going to war with Austria, Hungary, and Great Britain. You know it. You know it. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. But we do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven heavies. It's more than I normally have. All right, the mighty waffle is a little over well overweight. Austria, Hungary, and Japan signed a treaty. Oh no! So if I go to war with with, okay, if I go to war with any of those, I'm at war with all of them. That's just great. Oh god, a political murder in the Balkans. Oh fuck. Austria, Britain, and Great Hungary. Yeah, exactly. Oh, God. There should be a diplomatic... We're, going, we're probably going to war with three nations. There's not really... There's no option to not increase the tension. Prepare to defend yourselves! Counterintelligence believes Great Britain has stolen technology and naval aviation heavier than air from us. We should definitely not get upset over a little spying. Uh, new medium bomber. D Let's see, uh, improved bomb load. Let's 
its range is smaller. I'm gonna stick with the one we get. Wait. Mm, cruising speed. This one's got a much higher range. I'm gonna stick with that one. Oh, okay. Yeah, Great Britain's getting a little pissy. Oh, God. Blood for the blood god. Blood for the blood god. Blood for the blood god. Um, I'm sorry, but Mathis, it is... You've had an illustrious 30-year career, but it is time to do away with the, the Imperator Mathis there. Now that we actually have our mighty Vafel. All right, so add air unit, fighter. Because you make me sad. Because hey, go Ducat. Fire everything. Fighters, add air unit, torpedo bomber. Add air unit, torpedo bomber. There we go, fill her out. Intelligence report that the British Navy has a majority of their ships at active status. Don't worry about it. Better pre-battle enemy strength um, improvement, good. Uh, developed a fighter of its own initiative. Man, these guys are really into... No, I don't like it. Uh, it has half the firepower. Slower speed, similar range, half the firepower, and uh, uh, the medium bomb load is non-existent. Nope. Oh, oh god, the British went down to the Germans. Got Whoa, everybody hates Russia. All right, we're role-playing Russia. Everybody hates us. This is fine. This is fine. Um... And we were, to, uh, we were, we do need to immediately design a better light cruiser. Okay, 7,100 tons, 32 knots. Wow, that's fast. Uh, so the last one was 5,000 tons. These are doubles. We're gonna, I mean, don't we have access to triples? Yeah, we have triples. Fuck you. Uh, accommodations normal. We're gonna let's okay. Let, let's go up to six thousand tons. And it's he's so it's got nine five-inch guns. That's about a few. Insufficient time. Oh, what I'm thinking about doing is honestly just getting rid of one of these turrets and sticking with th with six five-inch guns. So, uh, delete this turret. That's still a far better design than the last one. Uh, director firing, dual purpose. Give her half a dozen of those. And we do need more ammo on these, because they run out. Don't I have better six-inch guns? Yes, I do, but I, uh, I'm not gonna put six-inch guns on these bad boys, because that's going to significantly increase the weight and a light cruiser is not exactly designed for a knockdown, drag out slug with someone. Quality one, uh, fire control position up. We need to reduce the amount of to aircraft guns. There we go. As the the uh, oh, the turrets, it needs to be well. Let's give it three inches on the turrets because these are actual turrets. 175, 30 knots, oil fired, inclined belt. I don't think it's gonna make that big of a difference on a light cruiser. All right. Probably not gonna, because we just built four new light cruisers that are just honestly not that good comparatively. Probably not going to make what very many of these right now. Because uh, I would like to lay down either a pair of new heavy cruisers or a upgraded Apple class. Hey, Macasloth. Ahoy. Let's give it a do Wait, no, that's going to significantly uh, increase the, anti the normal anti-aircraft battery there. Um, I don't think there's much else to do. I can't, I don't think I can get another knot out of her. Not easily. 
What about torpedo protection one? Tor just, a l just the slightest bit of torpedo protection wouldn't make me happy. 60, that, that's still, a, that's still small for a heavy cruiser. Midge, um, do you, no, you're right here. The midge ski. You're good to go. Uh, that's, that's pretty, that's pretty decent. i fill the rest out with ammunition. Yeah, there we go. Director for secondary guns not developed. All okay. Hayate, you do not have a ship right now, I don't believe. I don't think you've uh, been picked. The Skaleen? Boom. Alrighty. Uh, oh, Bidge, did you see this yet? I'm so happy with that. Hey, there's our new light carrier too. And the other light cruisers. British, the new British battle cruiser, the incomparable. You guys are really twatty with the ways you <laughs> the way you name your ships, FYI. Oh god. Alright, so we've got the uh this is not brand new. It's a rebuild probably. Nine 16 inch guns, all forward armament. Man, you British. Look at you. What is the second? Uh, 14 six inch guns and a relatively light. Oh, they're dual purpose. Well, there's only six three. It's anti aircraft armament for a 42,000 ton ship, is relatively small. But still, that's a, that is a hell of a battle cruiser. It is a hell of a battle cruiser. You want a new a, a new ship, uh, NP40? How about uh, enables twin turrets? In okay, uh, we're gonna lay down two of these right now, and what we'll do is in in. in NP402. There we go. And you're in 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 shower HMS Glowworm. Wait, is the Glowworm actually the name of a British ship? Um, the, the our heavy cruisers. There's not that many of them, but I like them. Um, the most miscellaneous class and the Albertskis, unfortunately, will probably get thrown to their doom in this next war coming. Uh, part of me wants to design a new battle cruiser. No, 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 no. We're not designing a new battle cruiser. What if we just designed a upgraded Apple class and built some more of them? Because I can increase its tonnage without uh, by a thousand tons without it throwing me an error. And its current design is really nice. I don't think I'm allowed to ink change the main gun without it being a bitch. No, but that's okay. Its armament has proved worthy. Only two late cruisers. Uh, I, I wanted to... I mean, I just built these four. And um, I wanted to lay down some new biggies. Missile cruiser thing? Yes, later on. There are missile cruisers. Um, problem is, is like, how far can we go before it's... Oh, yeah, see, look. You know, 24 knots. Increase the belt. Can't do too much without it, be, without it not being a, uh, like, a redesign. 
or uh, an entirely new design. Well, we can put the secondaries in doubles. I should be able to do this too. Put the tertiaries in doubles. Okay. That's, this is fine. I just, I don't want to go too crazy with the, um, with, I, I do want it to be a, uh, a, a, to save money. If I design it after the Apple class, it's cheaper to build. I think your storm from last night came from Ohio. Yeah, if anybody was watching the stream last night, I, I wrapped it up about 75 minutes early because the storm was rolling through and I was like, hey, you never know when, you know, a storm's gonna knock out power in Florida. I turned off the stream and maybe 40 seconds later, power went out. Uh, I'm gonna give her an incline belt. She's gonna be significantly more armored than the last, uh, the last class. But she's gonna have the same primary armament. She's gonna be more heavily armed and armored, though. Slightly faster, too. She has a relatively wide... I mean, and I'm gonna say that's an average immunity zone, 4,000 yards. And that's against high-quality 15-inch guns. Don't have increased elevation yet. Three inches on the deck is really heavy. Ahoy hoy. Are you licking the the, 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 the the batter of the brownies? I think you are. I'm good. Why don't we give the extended belt uh, another inch? Can we get more ammo in here? We can get more whoa, one more one one more tick of shells per gun. What is it in immunity zone anyway? An immunity zone is the the range at which a shell from your own gun would not penetrate your armor. So for me, if I was, if uh, if an enemy was firing 15 inch guns at me, quality one 15 inch guns at me, at 13, 14, 15, and 16,000 yards between there, they would not penetrate my armor, meaning that I would be immune from my own shells at that distance. At a shorter range, the penetration against the belt would go through my armor. At a longer range, the penetration against my deck would go through the armor because the deck, because longer ranges, the shells are going in at an angle. But still, that's a pretty good class right there. Look at that build time, though. Mother bitcher. 38 months. Russia, get your shit together. But, uh,. This is a rebuild, a redesign, so we'll give it a new uh, class name, too. It's built off the Comrade Apple. Yonto. Oh, God damn it. Austria-Hungary, you are such a bitch. Austria-Hungary. Now, if I go to war with Japan, Great Britain, Austria-Hungary, or Germany, I go to war with all of them. Oh god, I cannot I cannot fight four people at once. Resolve the crisis diplomatically. New fighter. Uh again, I like my old ones. Oh, Austria hungry. Well, at least I do have the money to lay down some new ships. That's something. Uh, Great Britain has stolen technology. <laughs> oh no, I gotta start taking prestige hits and the battleships are ready. I I'm gonna lay down two new ones. And okay, so it's gonna be the Anto. And the Mecha Sloth. Mecha Slothski, I like that. Sign a defensive pack with America. Unfortunately, that's down to um, that's down to luck. I don't get to I don't get to pick that for myself. I don't get to choose those. Um Oh god, I don't know what to do with the, these light cruisers. I think I'll just keep them around and send them to the um send them to the slaughter. Uh 
Then are you in the queue? Probably. I think there's 75 people in there right now, I think. Ah. There you are. Who do we got? Eliminator! Thanks for the diddly. Can never have enough raiders. You're not wrong. Yeah, they'll just get sent to the wolves. No worry there. Um. And what I'll do is I'll lay down two more light cruisers of these of this uh, diddle here. And you know what? We'll name these ones. These light cruisers are really nice. The suck. And what was the other one? The suck and the Edwark. Bam. We, and that still leaves us some wiggle room. Uh, internal upheaval in Sumatra. Great Britain is apparently sending a four. Oh God. Oh no. Uh, no concern of ours. I can't fight four nations at once. New docks completed. Hey, reduced dud rate on my shells. Good. Uh, go ahead and build that dock size up again. I'm not buying tor uh, submarine tech. Airships are more reliable. Huzzah. Uh, how many air bases do I have? Only three. Can I expand them? Yes. Let's expand those air bases. I only have a few. Oh, God. Of turtle upheaval in Bougainville. Apparently, Great Britain is just sweeping across Asia. On those treaties less. I have no idea. I can't. I can't risk it. Mine laying subs. New torpedo bombers. Every year, they do this. They they upgrade. I mean, they're. I'm fine with it. Yeah. No, this one's significantly better. Higher range, higher firepower, more maintenance. No, 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 it's the same. Uh, but bomb loads are better, too. Throw it down. Go for the gold. <laughs> Just do it. <laughs> oh, you know what? I forgot to put mines on the new ships, didn't I? So these, these, these cruisers have mines. The newer models do not. Technology sharing agreement with Germany expired. They want to build another light cruiser. Sure, throw it down. Why not? British imperialism is threatening our sovereignty. It really is. The Canadian. Shooting competition for all ships of the Navy. Uh, yes. The nautical luck wins. Improved seven inch guns, which I don't think I'm honestly using right now. I don't think I have seven inch guns anywhere. Although, I mean, frankly, I am happy that we have two new battleships on the slipways right now and five new light cruisers. Oh no, I did. There's 30 mines on them. My bad. They're perfect. They're, oh, these things are, I just want to pinch their little light cruiser cheekers. I'll pinch them on their light, little light cruisers. New British light cruiser. Your light cruiser's a pansy. You hear me? A pansy. Major arms firm wants to sell ships to South America. Yup. Thank you. Well, tensions are just high with the really high with the British right now. Everybody else is pretty much okay. Well, nothing's happening. I'm happy with that. The new government wants to reduce naval spending. Nope. Improved directors on all ships. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Okay, first things first. The three comrades eights. Open design for rebuild. Improve director. Shiza! Oh no. Where am I gonna get nine tons? That I don't think these numbers are accurate. Fuck. 
I, I, I'm 100% certain that's not an accurate number. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, might as well, you know, you know what? Let's take the, app oh God, that's expensive. Uh, we'll take the opportunity to give her, give her some anti-aircraft armament. That's what we'll do. Okay, this is fine. Okay, so this is fine. Could I have any? Uh, oh, I got balls. Shit. It's fine. We'll go 30 guns. I don't like 31. Uh, I don't like odd numbers. Now it says 786. Okay, that was accurate for some reason. That's fine. Unfortunately, it will take a year because we're also improving the anti-aircraft armament and the... um. Uh, the what's it called? Oh god, no, no. Another political murderer in the Balkans, for the love of god! <laughs> there should be a diplomatic solution to the crisis! <laughs> if I go to war with with Japan, Great Britain, Austria-Hungary, or Germany, I go to war with all of them. That is terrifying. <gasps> hey, purpose-built carriers. All right, what's the next? What, oh, good, nothing's popping off the list anytime soon. Um, okay, this is fine. No, no, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Have I ever tried South African beer before? I don't think I have, but I love beer. Oh, God, there's been an uprising in Africa. Shiza! Speaking of Africa. Gunboat? Ah, God. I don't want to send anybody else to rebuild right now because I need the tonnage out there. Disarmament conference is being held in The Hague. No. I have two battleships on the slipways right now that are a third done. Oh, fuck. Don't sign any... The last guy who signed a peace treaty against my will got sent to the Gulag. Gulag! <laughs> they did it again! They did it again! I told you, if you sign a treaty, you're going to the Gulag! Okay, so Mekathlowski and the Anto both got scrapped. Uh, Germany scrapped the Hesed and the Wittelsbach. Uh, and Austria-Hungary scrapped the Kaiser. The British scrapped the Incomparable. The French scrapped, uh, two heavy cruisers duplex in the Porthau. The U.S. scrapped uh, a carrier, the Langley, and uh, the South Carolina, and the Arizona. Okay, okay, okay. We'll we'll lower. We'll we'll listen to chat. God bless it. Oh shit. Okay. Well, unfortunately, those ships just got scrapped, uh, which means we need to we need to redes. I guess we spent our money building more. Uh... Yeah, less tension, that's something. But now what we need to do is we have to re design a treaty a treaty cruiser. How high am I allowed to go? Sixteen thousand five hundred tons is what I'm allowed to allowed to do. That's a lot of weight on a heavy cruiser. It's only five years. That's true. It's true. I think I have better quality. No, I still don't. Wait. Seven inch. I don't have better quality. Oh, fuck. That's not. There's no way that's legal. No. Um. Can we go with nine inch guns? I might be able to get another turret on here. Yeah. Another triple turret. An aft. Uh, uh, aft. Aft superimposed. Beautiful. Uh, with, with heavy cruisers, I prefer more guns to larger guns. Always. Secondaries need two inches of armor. That means they're enclosed. 
Give him a dozen uh, dual purpose tertiary guns. Director firing. Proof director. AA. We have AA directors now. 60 tons in AA directors. Uh, add mounts for a couple torpedoes. I like those. You need more destroyers? Oh, yeah, I could always do that. But I'm on. Uh, Last time we built some treaty heavy cruisers, uh, I, I really, really rather enjoyed them. So uh, that's what we're doing right now, treaty heavy cruisers. I mean, theoretically, I could actually put a fifth turret on there too. Oh, above water to printer two is not research for heavy ships. So, so th there's a uh, a limit on that. Insufficient topside space, so I would need to reduce its anti aircraft armament to get that on there. But I don't think we need that. Oh, no, it's got a shit arc, anyway. Get rid of that one. Sea plane. I don't know if I've got... I can put a seaplane hangar on it, but I don't have catapults yet. So that means the ship would have to stop to utilize them. Hey, jump jump! Let's give it a six-inch belt. It's got two inches on the deck. I'm gonna give it a uh, one-inch on the extended belt. It's actually pretty heavily armored. Give it six inches on the turrets. Can I get another knot out of it? Nope. 30 knots is really fast still. Uh, ooh, more ammo. Yeah, because these guys rip through ammo like a monkey on a cupcake. Okay, is that legal? That is legal. So that's that 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 is my my Russian treaty heavy cruiser. Oh, tip in the scales at sixteen and a half thousand tons. You give it an inclined belt too. Wonder. Uh, let's see. Gun data. Immunity zone from thirteen thousand to seventeen thousand yards. If we incline the belt, it's the same immunity zone. Still is, there is, uh, incline belt doesn't increase the probability of a, of a ricochet. It is a sexy cruiser. The Spanish designs that died really fast. Although, I gotta say, the secondary guns, I don't like that. It needs to have an even number on each side. Twelve. Uh, hundred tons left. What does that do? Unity zone is still way out there. No, I don't have torpedoes um, unlocked for ships this big yet. Um... If I go to six and a half inches on the belt, how much ammo do I have to lose to fit it? Oh, I still, I still give me 130 rounds per gun. Uh, yeah. All right, so who's this gonna be named after? Vincent de House. He's gonna be the Maxim. Uh, Maxim Vince. All right, so there's that. New German light cruiser, the Theseus. Ah, that looks like a... That reminds me of a similar design. It's very similar to mine. More heavily armed, though. Tupolev Design Bureau designed a new flying boat. Uh, it's six years newer. Significantly improved over the old one. Lower maintenance, higher toughness, firepower is a little bit lower, but the range is huge comparatively, and a better bomb load. And again, an improved torpedo bomber. What's the difference? Uh, increased range. I'll take it. All right, now I can afford two of these without any issue. All right, so the Maxim Huzitz and the... Uh, Luginski, you are still afloat right now, I believe, my friend. 
Are you? You are. You are still afloat. Sorry, bud. We're moving on. I have a lot of money in the bank. I do. Beep. You got a new ship, too. Just, it's getting rebuilt as we, as we spill the, the working killer. All right, so this is the rename. I'm just gonna call it the worker. The worker. There we go. Ooh, these light cruisers are uh, approaching too. Oh, uh, well, uh, tension up a lot. International Squadron, let's do that. Man, does everybody hate me. My prestige suffers. All right, this is fine, this is fine. Here, let's invest in docks. Um, I'm thinking more air bases might be a good idea. Where's our current air bases? Singtao, Riga. Vladivostov, is that is that what it, where they are right now? Um, let's put let's put an airbase in Puerto Rico. Let's put an airbase in Western Russia. Wait, do I already have one there? I do. Finland. Do I have one in Finland? I've got one at. Hago, so we'll do one there. Build a fort base. We'll put in one more air base. Baltic states. So we've got one in Riga. Lebao. We'll we'll uh, we'll build one in each place in in the Baltic states. The other one was Revel. Boom. Get some more planes in the Baltic, because now the French are pissy. Wait, are the French the only ones who are not like in a? Okay, finish. Oh god. Training extra unidentified submarine torpedoed and sank a Corvette. It's definitely France's fault. Should we fight France again? Oh, spectacle testicles wallet and watch. It's the only person I could fight that wouldn't pull in the rest. Ah, there it goes. Cruiser engagement. Who is this? The nautical- Oh, the nautical luck of the Kirov. These are both, uh, refit, uh, heavy cruisers. Alright, we're at war! It's the only person I can fight without drawing in the entire planet. Alright, now, as long as this isn't a French heavy cruiser, or battle cruiser, all is well. Oh, shit. It most certainly is, and I can't get that to turn off again. Squad max, 28 knots, fuck the hell off out of there. That looks like, that's a pretty old design, but still. Not gonna. We theoretically should have planes. I don't, no, I can't, I can't tell the ground units or the air units what to specifically do. I don't know who that is. Oh, it's, they're heavy cruisers. 10 10 inch guns. You overcompensating for something, buddy? Think we could take. You think we could go two on two? This one, this one can, this one can fight. This one's a shit box, though. And mine are more heavily. And did Kirov already get slowed down? Two knots down. Oh, she already took significant damage, though. The French have much larger guns on theirs than I have on mine. That's a problem. Do it. They're fat. Are they going faster than me? Not rated for 28 knots. Rated for 27 knots. Three hours until the sun goes down. This could be. Uh, this could get ugly. There's another hit. Especially if those those are 10 inch guns. Those are doing damage. Be a shame if I lost these ships right after I rebuilt them. Turret disabled on the nautical luck. 
No, turret destroyed. That's not good. I don't think there's any getting out of this. Only 45 minutes have passed. Significantly slowed down. I just saw fire spreads. We have to we have to turn and fight, unfortunately. Or sacrifice the Kirov to let the other one the other ones go. God, this thing won't turn off. I can't get this to stay off now. Yeah, Kirov just, is just getting smashed to bits right now. She's down to, uh, you know what? Oh God, do we want to sacrifice the Kirov and... Do you, have, do you have torpedoes? Do you have torpedoes? What are the odds? What are the odds? I'm hoping that maybe if the nautical luck can cross the T on this bastard and just pummel her to bits, we can get away. Oh, did that torpedo just disappear? Because all she she only got four inches of armor at point blank range, four thousand meters. We're hit. We're hitting them. We're not disabling her guns. She's heavily damaged, but uh, we destroyed one. How bad are you? Oh, yeah, Kirov's gone. It's a fight for the soul of our nation. That was, that was a close one. Now you are gonna fire your last torpedo there. Okay, and you are gonna fire your last torpedo there, and we'll try to sandwich her. And she is heavily damaged. And getting pummeled from both sides now. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that looked like a hit. I think we hit her. I think we hit her. Uh, no, it just disappeared. Is that what happened? It just disappeared? What, did we just dud? I think we just dudded. I'm pretty sure we just dudded. I mean, this thing's fucked up right now. Let's see, one, two, three turrets down. Cause that looked like, that thing looked like it hit and it doesn't look like she's firing back anymore. What? No! What? From where? From how? At what angle? What trigonometry? Put a torpedo into my ship. I... Ah, I feel like what I need is a camera mounted directly above my head. So I could just, so when I go like this and just scream at the heavens, I could switch to that angle. All right, all right, this is fine. Oh, fuck me.
I mean, I'm pretty sure this ship isn't even firing back anymore. And we're just blasting its face off. It's Well, no, it's secondary battery's definitely still firing. The nautical luck limits flooding. All right, she's got the flooding under control. Let's uh, let's increase her speed again. Cure off is sinking. I know. How heavy is this ship? Sixteen thousand tons. Is this thing damaged at all? This thing's damaged too. It's a much older design. That probably even has coal-fired diddlies. Here, let's, uh, nautical luck hit in the engine room. Nautical luck hit the engine room. <laughs> Heavy damage and on fire. Well, I thought the flotation was under, the fl uh, flooding was under control, but maybe not. Just keep shooting this thing. It won't stink. Although, oh god, it's heavily damaged. It's not on fire anymore. But it won't sink. It's still shooting me. Oh wait, it's dead in the water now. All right, I think she's sinking now. Medium damage my ass. No, something's still firing. Wait, wait, which one? Wait, when did you fire a torpedo? Did I fire all of your torpedoes? Wait, they could reload? Oh, fuck me if I knew that. I, I, I didn't know they could reload. Flooding is still 20, it's not getting any, we haven't been able to limit the flooding yet. There's no way, okay, well. Your office sunk. I didn't know that the below water torpedo tubes could reload. I knew the above water torpedo tubes couldn't reload unless you have you specifically. Well, it's one for one right now. Both ships damaged. And they, I just took a hit. Oh. I think it's time to try to get out of here. Slow down to like eight knots. Head back to base before the ship sinks off screen. There's no, that's way too far to get away under any circumstances. There's not near enough time, so it's gonna be up to the fates. Even at max speed, no. She sunk. Even at max speed, she wouldn't have made it back. Well, there's two heavy cruisers down. I'm down to one heavy cruiser. I just paid a fortune to rebuild those. Um, let's see. Raider. Not radar. Uh, do you have planes on you? Theoretically? There we go. New BBs? Uh, uh, mm. One station. How much longer for these? Oh, they're just about done. Resume that. I don't even remember uh, halting it. Well, you know what? Let's put down another freaking heavy cruiser. It is 1930. Bip. Well, theory in, in nautical luck did just sink. Spelled with a U, right? Um, I'll put down one more. 
You respawned, exactly. Silent, the silent dragon. Oh, trade production, fudge. Oh God, 27, mother bitcher. Um, well, well, I guess I'll take some old destroyers. One, two, three, four, five. Trade protection. Uh, build, sh well, you know what? Shoulder design. Uh, I, you know what? Let's design a new Corvette so they go out of date. You know, we're going to build, build some new ones. Might as well. Uh, mine sweeping gear. That's the most important thing you could have. You can have mines, right? Cannot have a speed higher than 24 knots. Uh, cannot carry mines. Increase depth charge storage. Insufficient topside diddly. Fire control not the best available. Can you have a five inch gun on these bad boys? Yeah, that's fine. Can uh, theoretically make them smaller too to save on cost too. Uh, insufficient topside space again. I'm knock that back down to four. Save that. All right, there's the new light cruiser. Midge ski's been rediddled. Oh, great. Great start. This is why I'm turning submarines off in future games. First month of the war, the mighty waffles torpedoed in dry dock for five months. This ship hasn't even hit the water yet. Yep, this is why I'm turning submarines off in future games. This shit is BS. Cruiser engagement. French decline. Raid on enemy shipping uh, against French, French in the English Channel, sure. French decline. Build screen. Build me a dozen of them worthy for Mordor. Hit a torpedo, <laughs> sit by a torpedo in dry dock. Yeah, there we go. Makes perfect sense. Uh, so Zate's the last one. Air base in Puerto Rico, in Finland, in the Baltic states. Zate finished a reconstruction. Sukhoi Design Bureau uh, designed a fighter. Man, they do not want to design fighters that are better than my current uh my current one look at that uh it's slower it's got a slightly increased range but half the firepower more maintenance only with a little tiny bit of toughness and uh less capable in the bomb load area so nope enemy submarine torpedoed and damaged comrade air she'll be in dry dock for five months French had a, a scuttle, a heavy cruiser. A fleet battle. French decline. Battleship engagement. The French decline. What? Are you going to fight me at all? You got two... They don't have any ships. KJ! Our Eliminator gifted KJ a diddly. Huzzah. Uh, apparently, they haven't built any ships after the last trouncing I gave them. I'm going to leave the take the last heavy cruiser and put him on Raider. <laughs> Maybe that'll help keep him safe. Seventeen inch guns available. New flying boat prototype ready. Enemy so they have a hunt well there you go. They have a hundred and twenty subs. Cruiser engagement. Hey, they accepted. I should have battle cruisers too, right? Ooh, ooh! I've got the baseman who actually has doodles on him. All right, all right, all right, all right. Mission, naval strike. Load out torpedoes. Wait, what? Where are all the planes? Why are there only six available? 
Oh, you know what? He might not have his full uh, loadout. Because it takes time to recruit them now. They get raided by enemy subs. Yup. Ready strike. Okay. Oh, I think they're going. Who do I got? Okay. And I do have guy two two cruisers down here. I've got the Midski and the Loginski. See what happens. Scouts are out. Anti-submarine tech is passive, yes. Oh, shit. What is this? It's a heavy cruiser. Um, There's nothing else spotted, so... Oh, wait, wait. No, no. Okay, so I told you to ready those guys, and you did exactly what with them? All right, mid ski lands the first hit. I think I think we slowed her down too. Yep. There we go. Leginski gets two hits. Leginski hits again. So did they send out literally every single one of my planes on scouts? I think they did. There, Leginski's getting all the hits. Glory to Liginski. There we go. Yeah. Design destroyers that are just anti-subs. Uh, it's passive. You basically just tell them to put depth charges on in there, and that's all there is. To do. That's all there is. Well, at least this guy's gonna die. Oh my God! Yeah, Liginski just. That was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 12 inch shells just hit that ship. I don't think the French are building capital ships anymore. I think the French are just building subs. All right, well that went well, except for the fact that I didn't get to use my planes. Which is, you know, subs are just boring. So what it comes down to, subs are boring. This poor bastard. Torpedoed before she ever did anything. Let's actually take the take a look at the air group on... Yeah, it's not up to strength. It's only partially full. Padiski hits a mine. Did they just scrap a third of their subs? They went from one... 12 to 83 and I sank two Times if you destroy all enemy ships uh, then they can't actively fight you I mean the French are having trouble actively fighting me as it is because they only have two capital ships that was one of the new ones hey it's one of the new ones look at this look at this bad boy here look at that bad boy all right you nope weather does not allow cur uh, air operations well balls Subs are perfect for the French. They could just retreat and avoid actual combat. Last time I fought them, they had a fleet, and they just never replaced it. Hey, Solar Crook. You love Aratus? Oh, good, Leah. It is fun. Anything? Wait, what? Oh, I gotta sneeze. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa! Why do I have battleships out in 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 I just saw Alexandra's firing? Okay, no, it's fine. So I, there's two battleships out there. It was just a French light cruiser. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. This is fine, this is fine, everything's fine.
Unexpected advances in naval aviation lighter than air. Improved airship performance. Enemy torpedo, uh, submarine torpedo and suck a destroyer. Food is becoming scarce in Russia? Enemy operational subs, 111. Okay. Battleship engagement and the French decline. Raid on enemy shipping, the French decline. Oh, we need more music. Go to the Hoi 3 music. Um, estimate. So my estimates are off by what? 40%? Who's due to sub? This is why we're turning subs off in the future. They're fucking stupid. Clap tar 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 is in the yard. New Austrian light cruiser. It's lame. Uh, 1% weight saving on turrets. That'll help. Improvements to chip design. Advanced design calculations. 1% weight savings on hulls. Uh, enables superimposed X gun mounts on cruisers. Enemy submarine torpedo. How do and this is what I don't get? How do enemy submarines outgun my corvettes, the ships that are purpose built and designed for taking out enemy submarines? How does that happen? Enemy sub sunk five. Cruiser action. Sub only game. Never, never. <laughs> These are the new cruisers. So boring. I just thought of something. Do my new air bases have planes in them? I honestly don't know. Oh, it's just a couple destroyers. Unless they're old designs, they're probably gonna outrun me. 10 inch guns on their subs. The um the British put a 12-inch gun on a sub in World War One. I. I don't think it ever served during the war. Wildman, thanks for the diddly. I think I think it I, I I don't think it actually fired during the war. There was two built, one um I think one sank in an accident and the other one never did anything. fly like a like a fruit fly on my mic there I don't want to get any closer because of this apparently the National Geographic's completely crobakeyed out Doom! how how? How did that happen? With them just sitting here going in circles, and my ships had just taken a big ass turn. And they're going 30 knots. Womp 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 wow. You make me sad. <sighs> yeah, it makes me sad too. Well, it looks like she can eat eat it for now. You are fucking built for this. What is wrong with you? Literally your job. Are you even firing your guns? Wait, why? Did, are you still, how are you still attached? I mean, she's not flooding at all, so... Oh, she, her rudder's jammed. That's what's happening there. Her rudder's jammed. I was like, what are you doing out there? Yes. Literally, your job is to kill these. Just trying to make random movements. 
to reduce the chance of getting shot. Why did the French attack us? Uh, I honestly, it's only been like a month or two. No, nah, it's been like four or five months. I don't remember what the start of the war was. I don't remember what the inciting incident was. All right, that one's dead. She should be okay. And we could design some new, um, some new destroyers too, because we can have superimposed guns on destroyers now. There we go. All right, nobody sank. We're okay. Right, now we just have to wait till the first heavy ship is torpedoed and sunk. All right, let's see. Seven and eight months left for the new Corvettes. Two months left on the last Scanlan design. And then we've got 22, 26, 27, and 28 months on the Maxim Vince heavy cruisers. Okay, this is fine. Improved firefighting equipment. That'll help. Four more French subs sunk. We need to sink more than four per month, though, is the thing. Fleet battle. E. Earl Grey, hot. Battleship engagement. I'm, I'm winning just because the French refused to fight. Negotiated peace with us getting disputed border areas in some of their colonies. Yeah, you surrender? What? French decline. French decline. Canadians commissioned. Better torpedoes. Wait. That's a smaller range than the last upgrade had. Maybe it's a smaller range at like a much higher speed or something? Mastering dive bombers, new Austrian medium bombers, food's becoming scarce, minesweeper detected and swept a field in Northern Europe, four more sub sunk. Cruiser engagement, ew. Attack enemy ships in general, do it. I don't know what's out there, but do it. All right, Waffle. All right, there's more planes on here than there were before. Naval strike, torpedo, ready. Do it. And who do we got? Who do we got? We got uh, NP402. Um, I don't know why Zate's not joining the company, but we got the two battle cruisers. Can't build new subbies anymore. I can. I just think they're. I don't. I don't like to. I hate. Fucking hate subs. AV. That's. There's no way. Do it. That's, wait, they have two battleships. I know they have two battleships to their name. Do you think that's actually them? I have no idea that, e oh, it is. It's the last two, it's the last two French battleships. The Devastation and the Friedland. And they do have a seaplane carrier down here. It is a legit seaplane carrier, the Henrietta. Okay, Waffle. Where are my planes? They sent, they're sending the, all the torpedo bombers out on recon patrols. Is there a way to change that? No search. Motherfucker. Mijinsky and Luginsky just took 15 inch shells. It's unfortunate. Uh, okay. And I don't get to control my destroyers. Uh, gotta hit launch strike after ready strike. That's not how that works, colonists. That is not how that works at all. Maji okay, nope. Uh, they outgunned me. And I don't have any planes right now. I should be significantly faster than them. 24 knots, 22 knots. So maybe if we're lucky, we can wait for the planes to come in. If it would be fine if I could control my destroyers. Yeah, air is hella micro. 
I don't know where the the planes are. I told them to come back, but I don't know where they are. Is Loginski already slowed down? No, she's fine. Who is this? Oh, 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 please tell me. God damn it! I don't control the... I have my big battleships, but I don't control them either. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me, game? How long? How long? All right, all right. We move north. We lure them north. Majinski's finally take, uh, gotten a hit in. All right. Where are your fucking planes? All right, they're back. They're back. They're back. All right. Uh, no time to ready this. Just launch them as they go, as they come. Just launch. Just launch them as soon as they're good to go. Majinski's getting it pretty good right now. What I'm trying to do is lure them north. Turret disabled. Get them in range of the big guns. Devastation hit. Luginski! You need to get the fuck out of there. These destroyers, can I get them yet? Yes! Whoa, whoa, what happened? What the fuck happened? I, I was playing with my destroyers. What happened? The devastation's gone. Somebody tell me what happened. Because I didn't see a notification. Uh, I don't know what happened. I honestly don't know what happened. Oh! Well, I mean, that was the last, I mean, there's not a better time for this. So beautiful. I don't know, do this in Russia? Uh, yeah, go pick up survivors. All right, now the plane's got nothing to do. Midge, okay, the look at the ski got hit pretty good. I guess we go look for the rest of them. Okay, they're approaching somebody. I don't know what they're going after. There's, oh, there's something else. There's something left down here. So did the last did 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 Comrade Air or Crag just flash fire both of those? Is that what happened? Cause that's the only thing I could think of, is that they both got flash fired. I wanna sink the um I don't I think that's a d I wanna sink the Henrietta at least. Yeah, she's taking a couple hits. Uh-uh. 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 Nope, 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 nope. She's got, like, this little cap above her, which is cute. Uh, uh, hitting a destroyer with a 12-inch gun you think would be pretty devastating. Another one, it was one of these ones. I think it was that guy right there just got hit. All right, that was a six-inch gun. I'm here, Henrietta. How much damage? I mean, it's a, it was a little deflating considering I didn't do any of that. Midge is running out of ammo. Oh, but she's dead in the water. All right, time to leave.
Well, um... Raw? Because... Swampy Sniper. My because... first bits ever to the most deserving streamer. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Uh, oh, who are you? Is that a, that's a destroyer. Oh, those are all those destroyers I forgot about. Uh, okay. The entire French battle line flash fired. 70,000 tons of ship. I, and I'm gonna go ahead and give, uh, both those kills to Comrade Air, considering he was the only one packing guns that I think could actually do that. I mean, theoretically, a lucky close-range strike with a 12-inch 12, 12 could definitely do it, but he had 15-inch guns at quality 1, so chances are it was he just got two fucking kills. Then they lost their, uh... What did you think that destroyed? Okay. Is that a carrier? They actually did have a carrier out there somewhere. But, uh, stunning victory. I went up... 15,000 points on them. You can build a new 17-inch ship. Uh, if I did, it would probably be a battle cruiser. I would like a more heavily armored version of my battle cruisers. Um, but I need to take a really quick uh, bio break, so hang on a sec. Penelope! I need Penny! Penelope! Penny, come! Oh, I hear pitter-patters. Ah, pitter-patter a petty pee. Okay, Penny. Penny, come here. You know how this works. Up. Oh. Good. Yeah, there we go. Boop. Okay, you stay here. Yeah, you stay here, and I'll be right back, okay? You entertain the people. Put the hat. Oh, no, if I put the hat on her, she would just start ripping all the fluff off of it. Okay, you stay there. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. That's delicious. Okay. Well, just, I just smell like treat. I gave you two. I gave you the two treats. Now. Probably hand. I didn't. Well, no. It's, it's framed pretty good. Let's see. Let's grab this webcam. Drag it down just a hair. Get a little more, more petty face in there. A little more face. my hand or are you good she seems like she's pretty good she seems like she's good yeah that's that's a good girl right there can we get back to the game penny or do you need oh i was gonna say i just said can we get back to the game she goes oh, oh. good girl good girl yeah Okay, okay, yeah, you can have my hand. <laughs> you are such a goofball. It's your hand now. Oh, puppy yawn. Thank you, Penny. Okay. Can I put your back? Yeah. Yeah, thank you, Penny. Alrighty, we're back. 
Alrighty then. Oh, right. War with France. Oh, uh, you know what? We do have a little bit of cash in the diddle right now. Uh, we have access to big doodles. Uh, why don't we design ourselves um, a, a new battle cruiser design that has the... That is... Uh, it's got the opposite so, uh, type of armament. So, with the Zate design, um, they those things are uh, armed with 12... 12 inch guns so this time i think what we're going to do is we're going to arm it with fewer guns but of a large diddly all right so we have access to 17 inch guns okay okay uh what i'm going to do is i'm going to decrease the number of guns in all the turrets to two because these are fucking mammoth. That'll save me the weight to wiggle around. Improved director, fire control position. Uh, 12 5 inch guns in double turrets. That's my standard diddly. I'm going to put in way more of these. I'm going to give it a dozen. Uh, <laughs> I see I see someone said penny emote. Wait, I one of them was it was penny, 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 and hey guys, um, thirty knots, so it is faster. I'm gonna give it an incline belt, which is more expensive, but that's fine. It's very low on armor. That is, that is true. Check what ships the French have. That those were their last two heavies. Uh, the last time I looked at the almanac, they had zero other heavy ships. It was those two were the last ones that, that were um, active. Turret's got good armor. Deck's huge. The belt is pretty slim. Let's go to 12 inches on the belt. It's got basically no immunity zone, but it's a bat It's an overgunned battle cruiser. Is there a queue up for naming ships? Of course there is. It might be full. I'm not sure right now. Well, we can look. Uh, there. It is not full. And Wretched Hammer, you're on it. <laughs> there we go. Because we did we did uh, pull a bunch of names off from before. I don't expect there to be an immunity zone on a ship with 17-inch shells. Insufficient topside space, so it could reduce the number of these. And we are probably going to want to put more ammo in there. Uh, let's go ahead and go up to... We go to 120 safely. It looks like we can. Not bad, really. Not bad. Super firing aft. Uh, another turret in the in the in the rear is going to cost me 20 two, 200 tons that I just don't have to work with. Uh, where do the sound effects send to? Uh, Twitch, PM on Twitch. T Earl Grey hot. T Earl Grey hot. Well, I did have some of that earlier. The deck is massive. I could, I mean, I could save weight by taking armor off the deck and go to three and a half tons. But I'm not gonna put out another turret. Um, if if I can get more guns by adding in a, a triple, a ch switching out one of the doubles for a triple, and that would give me more guns, uh, and cost way less weight. But I'm I'm interested in it's a battle cruiser. It's not supposed to be heavily armored. I'm I'm interested in the design to be six 17 inch guns. That was the plan for this. I can, oof. We have some room to work with. We do have some room to work with here. Um Let's go to 14 inches on the turrets. 14 inches on the counting t counting tower. 12 and a half on the belt. 30 knots is fast. Uh, I go up to 43,000 tons, so I could give it more displacement too. That'll get me 31 knots.
A cheetah to hunt down the weak. That's why it's, it's it's like it's several hundred tons to get that extra knot out of her. The 31 knots on a battle cruiser is zippy, is what it is. It's zippy. Um, you don't understand why it work, won't work for some people? Well, I mean, let me double check to make sure it's not working on my end. I mean, every single time someone said it hasn't worked and then I checked, it worked on my end just fine. Yeah, I just got a PM to myself on, on, on Twitch. Uh, it giving me the list of sound effects. You know what I'll do is, um, as a, as a backup for my next, before, uh, I'm not gonna do it right now, but I'll do it for my next stream. I'll put in a um, I'll, a list in Discord as well that you can access through there. Oh, I know the ship might not get the design speed. That's why I'm nervous about spending like 700 tons. No, more than that. No, I'm not. That's way too much tonnage on a, on a maybe. We'll, we'll, we'll put it at, at 30 knots. Um, and you know what I'll do is I will, I will increase its secondary battery to 20 five inch guns and I will increase its tertiary to, uh, 24 dual purpose and then I'll knock down the AA because the dual purpose guns are dual purpose. Now, is that legal? That is legal. Do you think I can get a trip? No. I was about to say, you think I get a triple turret? Too much. Yeah, it's a thousand tons for another gun. You thought there was already a list on Discord. Um, Well, I took it off of Discord because nobody ever looked at it because they, they could, you would always just use the chat command. And then just recently, I, in the last two weeks maybe, I started getting people telling me, hey, the chat command's not working for me. Um, which I don't, I don't know what the issue with that is because it works perfectly fine for me and for like, I don't know, 80% of people, but I'll put it back up in discord. Uh, I could always shave off some displacement at this point. Or right, we'll give it 13 inches on the belt or it's, it's saying it's a battleship now. If I go, if I give it, go up to 13 inches on the belt. Uh, it throws it throws me as a battleship. Why don't we give it one and a half, one and a half on the extended belt? Uh, yeah. And then I'll just knock the last three hundred tons off. And boop boop boop, pick a name. For my my new 17 inch gun totem wolf beautiful totem wolf ski wolf, wolf sh shalov boom save four months design to design it new docs completed army wants more resources uh no i got this japanese fighter the nakajima shinden has entered service Cruiser, that's one of the new ones, has uh, struck a mine and sunk, wasn't it? Or is it, if it was an old one, I don't care. Uh, it was a medium one. Uh, raid on, uh, enemy raid on my shipping, French decline. Raid on shipping, French decline. Small engagement. Hey, I got it. Place the obsolete ships, and eh, most of them are good. I mean, a lot of the most of the obsolete ones are just light cruisers, and uh, the, generally what I do with light cruisers is I just uh, I sail them until they're dead, until they sink. That's that's usually the gist of it. No contact. The French had two Mr. Corvettes and nothing else. Mr. B Double O Z. Four, man, we got what well, we're worth. France, our yearly budget is just through the roof. I can't believe I've got four new heavy cruisers coming, and I still have um, money. Cause look at the, look at the cost on these bad boys. Enemy sent out feelers through neutral nations about negotiating peace without border changes. No. 
Our side gaining large. Didn't that say without? Whatever. Okay. What do I? What am I stealing? Um. I'm gonna take Corsica and China. Smoke floats. Nice. The Bolton Paul Botha is entered service. I don't care. All right, this is fine. My diplomats don't listen. No, they do not. Generally, whenever I have sent diplomats out, they do the opposite of what I want them to do. But we want a war with France, and we just got access to uh, some Mediterranean holdings is what we did. Corsica now belongs to Russia. So uh, what we could do is use that as a base to fuck up the Mediterranean. Which one's this? Is this? That's the Russian Far East. That's Sakhalin. Tsingtao. Tongqing is mine. And so is uh, Cochin China. So Vietnam, outside of Autumn, is, is mine. Is Russian now. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, well, battleships. Uh, and heavy cruisers, reserve fleet, please, to save me money. Budget's still workable, too. It might be time to... I mean, normally I would take the, the old light cruisers and just run them into the ground. Um, I'll just leave them on foreign station. Because I, I, need, I need ships on foreign station now, so there's that. Um... Everybody else is basically good. I'll moth or not mothball, but I'll put the um, the light carriers on uh, on reserve as well to save cash. Armor development, gradual improvement in armor quality and one percent weight saving. Fixed AA barrage zones, improved effectiveness. Corvettes have been commissioned. Spy from the U.S. Lynch him. Totem Wolf Wolfshalov is ready for construction. Go to the build screen. And of course, we're going to lay down two new battle cruisers. I always, I always lay down ships in at least pairs. The Roham. It's the ride of the Roham. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Um, the oldest Corvettes. I will get rid of. Old ships cost more to to keep up. And then what I will do is I'm going to build another run. Uh, uh, let's say, yeah, another full run of these Corvettes. Try to basically try to keep the Corvettes new. Um, and maybe some new destroyers, too. Yeah, what I'm going to do is... Oh, these guys look... Eh, they still got torpedo doubles, at least. Gradual increase in anti-submarine warfare capability. Huzzah. New Japanese light carrier. I've already seen it. It's uh, very comparable to mine. Slightly bigger, and that went into armor. Oh, German medium bomber. The Focke-Wulf uh, FW-124. That's fine. Let's see how, much, how many months left on the cruisers. Year and a half-ish. I got money. It's okay. Faster and cheaper to just refit them. Uh, uh, small ships? No. Re you really shouldn't... I mean, even light cruisers generally aren't worth a refit. Um, a lot of times it would be like... You're, you're A lot of times with the smaller ships, you're looking at much smaller uh, margins. And, and usually what you could do is like, okay, I could pay just a little bit more and get a ship that's like 50% more capable. Um... But with the big ships, the big ships are almost always worth it. Unless you get to the point where the hull is just wrecked, um, is just too old to be worthwhile. Yeah. Usually heavy cruisers and up, I will refit. Uh, heavy uh, light cruisers and down, I'll just scrap. Yes, I do need uh, new DDs. Magazine box protection. Didn't get that, though. Better aircraft practices increase aircraft capacity and ready times for carriers. Counterintelligence believes Japan is stolen technology in shipboard aircraft operation. 
but the Japanese can suck it. I do want to make sure I have enough Corvettes, though. A lot of all these new Corvettes popping off. Uh, let's go ahead and design a new destroyer, though. Oh, you know what? Um, how's this design? 30 knots, 1,200 tons. Nine torpedoes. Uh, there's, there's nothing wrong with this design. We just build more of these. There's absolutely nothing wrong with it. It is listed as an older design, but it's... There's nothing... There's, there's absolutely nothing wrong. We'll lay down another half a dozen. Japanese light cruiser. Ew. Wait, you laid that down in 1930? That? You pansy? Synthetic fire control computer reduces penalty for uh, firing when ship is turning. Nice. New French fighter. Lame. New French bat. Okay, the French finally laid down a new design. L let's let's take a look here. Nine thirteen. Ooh, interesting. My battle cruisers could beat it. K guns. Those are anti-submarine guns. Um, basically depth charges that fire forwards out of the ship. 11 inch belt, 9 13 inch guns. So my battle cruisers have 12 12 inch guns or 6 17 inch guns. So either way, I think my battle cruisers could take on the new French battle cruisers. They're probably saving a fortune not having to pay anybody in the Navy. New revolution in an African country. Send a squadron. Start pumping up those numbers again. Another round of fighting is broken out in the Balkans. No doubt the meddling of... Who's meddling? Who is meddling? Germany, Austria, Hungary. Do they still have... I don't know. I think it's the U.S. Increase in shell damage. Is there a way to see treaties? Then the Almanac. Like, if we go to... Austria-Hungary was the, the linchpin. I don't see any information in here. Yeah, look at the French Navy right now. Zero... Zero. They have four light carriers, four heavy crew. Man, I really ate the French for breakfast, didn't I? Oh, that felt good. Never be able to get Sardinia, can't I? Oh yeah, because Italy is not a actual participant. Shameful display. Oh, you know what I should do though? Um, area, Corsica. Air base. Let's build. Shameful um, display. Shameful display. Uh, let's build a couple six-inch batteries there, because those uh, spawn mines. And air base, Corsica. Which one did I build already? Saint Florent. There we go. Can I you make me sad. improve base? Yes, please. Thank you. Spending a lot of money right now. Spending a lot of money. And I need to improve the fire control computers on my most of my heavy ships. Okay. 14-inch coastal battery. I don't think I ever, ever bother building more than 6-inch coastal batteries. Anything over that is just a waste of money, I usually think. Because uh, the, the Zates all got the new fire control computers, but nobody else did. Oh, yeah, we're going to start popping stuff off pretty quickly. The five months, the heavy cruisers are going to start finishing. New Corvettes. Political murder to the Balkans! Demand the guilty party be brought to justice. Looks like it was Austria. Finished construction of our airbase. Yes, copy the, uh, the diddle over. That's fine. Japanese are offering to sell us rights to torpedo te uh, technology enhanced pressure bottles. Sure. So I want to make sure these are filled out, which they are in no way filled out. Why is this empty? 
Or is it set to zero? What is this supposed to be set to? Ten. It is set to zero. They're all supposed to be set to ten. Why is that set to zero? That Those are all right. Set, it's set to ten. And these need to be changed. Add air unit. Torpedo bombers, 20. And unit, torpedo bombers, 20. Yeah, these are all empty. These are all empty. Puerto Rico, nah, I don't need to improve that. Uh, fighters. 10. Add a unit, uh, torpedo bomber is 10. Okay, we'll just do this real quick, like. And keep, I'm going to keep, I, I tend to keep my, my air units active at all times. Even if it's expensive. Oh god, there's so many of them. I did just build two more, too. I feel like there should be, a, I, th I think the new patch added um some, some functionality to this. I don't want to patch the game mid game, patch the game mid game again, and risk uh, it blowing up on me. This is the last one though. Air unit torpedo bomber, and this one's all set and ready to go. Okay, we're good. Uppressing China makes it necessary to send an expeditionary force. Oh, yeah, send everybody. Hey, dive bombing available. Finished construction. That is not a six-inch battery. <laughs> New Austrian light cruiser. Again, lame. And our new new heavy cruisers are just about finished. Ship is trouble reaching design speed. But at least it's saving our economy. But she is armed to the teeth. Hell of a heavy cruiser. Up, uh, turtle upheaval in Borneo. Someone has to shoulder the burden. Austria-Hungary, wait. Austria-Hungary acted faster getting to Borneo than Russia did, who has access to the Pacific Ocean directly? Whoa, that pissed off the British too. Better quality 13 inch guns, which I'm not currently using. This is fine. New Brit, ooh. That outdoes me. But then again, mine are not designed for toe-to-toe -to -toe fighting. Mine are designed for raiding. Oh my god. Nothing even happened in there. Okay, okay. No, this is fine. Mobilize. Mobilize everything. Wait, what would... Trouble reaching your design speed. Her design speed was 29 knots, wasn't it? Oh, no. It was 30. Shit. Hundreds and hundreds of tons of machinery to waste. Uh-oh. I don't have any cruisers over here. Wait. Who's over here? Who the fuck are you? Oh, it's one of those old cruisers. I was like, you know what? You'll just die. That's what'll happen is you'll die. I'm sorry. Well, you've got torpedoes. So if, um, wait, you know what? The Austro-Hungarians are probably garbage too. Uh, 6,000 tons, 26 knots. Six inch guns, six inch guns. Can I invade Borneo? It might be within range, but I have to check. I don't know. Nope, we took two hits. These are old ships. My old ships and their old ships. This, this is, I wonder, do you have coal engines? Is there any way to see? Crew quality, minus one. No, that's not good. 
I have no idea if you you can see where the if there's what engines are on this. Hey, oh, we got a hit. There's another one. I was about to say, just fucking die. You go, just you go to your go to your doom and and be happy. But uh, that guy's only got three guns on him. As long as we can land more hits than he lands on us, we're fine. Although that doesn't seem like it's gonna happen. This is a very poor cl crew. Garbage versus garbage, yeah. I'm starting to get some hits. That looked like a good. Ooh, you know what? I got a plan. Okay. Expended? What? Oh, you fired at your. S and you missed. You're just. You're. That's just special. What that is. Leave it to Papa Magnus. See? Leave it to Papa Magnus. Well. Didn't actually expect anybody in the Far East to do anything, but there you go. Um. I mean, I might send uh, some ships out to the Far East if it, if it, if it, if it need be, but let's see. What's our invasion range look like? Borneo is outside of air invasion range, but the British have lots of stuff in invasion range, it looks like. Uh, even in the Caribbean down here. We're going to find the updates. Uh, should be pretty easy. Let's see. Google. Roll the waves. See what pops up. And there it is. It's the first thing that popped up when I, uh, here, I'll, I'll get you a link. Boop. There it is. That's the newest update. Oh, trade protection, right. I have new Corvettes for this. And old Corvettes. Let's see what happens. Yup, there it is. So, um... I was at war with Austria-Hungary for one month before the British decided to join in. Let's do it. Wait, victory point reset? What? Wait, why did the... Wait, what? How is that fair? How is that fair? And now I just lost a light cruiser. Please tell me it was the Kublyashev is an old one. No, it's one of the middle ones again. We got uh, a British ship hit a mine. They called a mine. All right, all right. Why are you blue? What the? F is this ship? Is this a trader ship? What is this? What is this nonsense? What do we got? What do we got? Destroyer and what? And another like cruiser. Aspern class. Ten five inch guns. Smaller guns, but more of them. Probably would be go would this will probably go bad for me. Unless we get some Oh, you just Oh, we almost had it. That's a good shot. Coal bunkers. These are still coal-fired ships. Oh, she just... Her speed just dropped to three. That's not what you want to see. You know, you still got a torpedo? Oh, there it is. I was like, where's my button? That was, a ba that was a bad hit. Didn't take very many hits, but one of them was uh, pretty critical. Although, that was a good fusillade of gunfire right there. Just knocked out three turrets with that salvo. Still firing. Oh, that's a British light cruiser. Thought it was a destroyer. What, what do you got? 
Above water torpedo tubes and six inch guns. Magnus likes stress again. Yes, it does. Let's see if we can throw a torpedo out there. I have no idea where that's heading, but okay. Oh! Right underneath! Oh, we're down to zero knots. That's a pretty low speed. But she's still firing. Yeah, we got, we got no control. How many hits did they get off? Only nine? No, the secondary battery got eight. Oh! And then her magazine blew up. Okay. So question is to send a couple ships out to the far east or to not send a couple ships to the far east new medium bomber oh that's an improvement right there oh I'll take that one battleship in in oh wait they're invading uh, wait one force is an area, one light cruiser, enemy forces, two light cruisers? British decline. I need ships over there. I need to send some ships over. So we need some ships here. Southeast Asia. Alright, so who do we want to move? Let's take, um... Uh, God, the old heavy, one of the old heavy cruisers and one of the new heavy cruisers. Take the, uh, the remainder of the Albert skis. Do we want a flagship? Do we want to send a flagship? Uh, you know what? I'm going to send, um, the two Alexandras out. This is Southeast Asia. If I could find it, there's Northeast Asia. The Nautical Fuck 2 has been commissioned. Enemy set out feelers through neutral nation about negotiating peace without border changes? No? Submarine torpedo and damage Mitski. Fleet battle! Oh, you're coming to my house? Oh, the British are coming to to, Ma to, uh, to Shea Magnus. Hey, Occubird. Mm-hmm-hmm-hmm. Mm-hmm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I got both my light carriers. I got my two uh, big gun battleships, the 15-inchers. I've got, uh, oh, you know what? I've got Leginsky and I've got Zate. I would have had Midgeman, too, if he hadn't just gotten torpedoed. All right, you are going to fall in behind. Um, not that one. The Leginski, because you could keep up with them. You are going to screen for the worker. You are going to screen for uh, Leginski. First things first, no air search. Cap medium. All you guys, naval strike, torpedoes. Oh, the sun's coming down. Wait. This is deck load, really? I guess I'll send them off in two pairs. Ready, strike. They got battleships out here somewhere. And you are going to screen for the Mighty Waffle. I don't need them to send uh, send guys out searching because I just need caps out. We should. Oh, I have. I should have air superiority here. No issue. I have air bases all over the Baltic. Yeah, unknown ship sighted already. This, uh, sighted his battleships. Ready. 
Torpedo bombers, I don't care that the sun's coming down. You are going to go out there, and you are going to hit those fuckers. You're, they're going to go right there. Launch, wait, no, now it's saying it's fine. Launch strike. Uh, the other two, boom, boom, ready strike. Let's do this. No, no survivors, I approve of this message. Oh yeah, those are real ships. They're firing at that range. Those are real ships. What do we got? We got the New Zealand class battlecruiser. Oh, look at that. that I, re I remember this bad boy. Light armor. Big old guns though. Big old guns. Got about a few of them. And the destroyers are like, dun 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 Worker just took a hit. He's going the wrong direction. Um, I've told him to get in behind these guys and he went straight at the enemy. Comrade Air just took a hit. Two New Zealand classes. So these guys down to 22 knots and fall in between the, behind the other ones. Okay, and airplanes. Boop, boop. The other ones are off. Torpedo bombers. Have them head up this way. And launch strike. You poor bat. Did you please tell me they didn't hit your engines. I have not hit them yet. Oh, wait, wait. 12 inch gun and a 15 inch gun on both of them. And this guy got hit by something. Oh, a light cruiser shot him. Okay, you are. They are. Who are you? They're firing at the little guys, is what they're doing. Oh, that might actually work out. New Zealand hit with another 15-inch gun. What I want to do is start knocking out those turrets. And and we desperately uh, need the... Uh, what? Did you guys just see that heavy cruiser take a 90-degree turn? Did, did you see that? Hey, Total Wolf! Oh, you got a ship coming, Total Wolf. 17-inch guns. The bow cruiser. He may have misunderstood signals because now he's not a answering me. Another 15 inch hit. Because these guys got light armor, so these are probably doing some good damage. He is going straight in there. Yep, no chill. No chill. I don't. Did he? Did he? Did he misunderstand orders? Is that what it was? I didn't see it. But he is going straight at the enemy, and I have no control over him. British turned around. That is so good. They can't fire backwards. They're all forward guns. They can fire back over their shoulder, you know, like at my light chips, but they, they're all forward guns. They can't fire back at them. They can fire at the guy who's, you know, going straight at the enemy for some reason. Died him? Oh, one of these guys. Uh, I'm a little sad that the worker is probably going to die. Oh, it looks like I can finally get him to turn. Nope, he's just... I don't know what's going on here. I honestly don't. I have no control over him. He's just doing what he wants. Where are those... Pl oh, there's the planes. There they are. Oh wait, they got more back here. The Benbow class? Ten Whoa. You have the audacity to call a ship with six and a half inches of belt armor and 10, 10 inch guns a battleship? That's a heavy cruiser, you bitch. The item's getting it pretty good right now. Let's see, light damage, light damage to each of them probably. Are they gonna make a run? Comrade Air just took two hits. Oh, I, did, I just saw rudder fix, so there was definitely a rudder issue down there. Two Benbow class, I'm not worried about them. That 
Anson. Where's the Anson? Wait, are these Anson? Oh, here it is. What do you got? 14 inch guns. That's a little better. I'm not doing good so far. They're getting way more hits in than I am. Benbow hit by a uh, 12 inch gun, finally. New Zealand lands another hit. But they're going in. At least they're, they've, they've all arrived at about the same time, which is good. No hits yet, though. Benbow hit, Benbow hit. Anson hit a couple times. Six inch guns. The Loginski is, these guys are firing their six inch batteries. We're too close. You know what it's time for? Good old fashioned Russian suicide mission. Turret disabled up here. I mean, we're still doing good. Although, I don't know. 23% damage and what is that, 16% damage I think it said? That's not good enough. And our torpedo bombers have completely whiffed. We have not hit anything yet. I'm interested in, in, in getting the ants in here. You. Which one is my uh, prime? This one. Fire torpedoes at the Anson. Please tell me that's a spread of torpedoes and not just a torpedo, by the way. Oh, good, it is. You, fire torpedoes at the Anson. Fire. Fire torpedoes at the Anson. Fire. AI control. Take it back. That was a hit. That's a hit. Looks like we may be able to get a third. No such luck. Two hits on the Anson though. So that was a pretty good uh, fusillade. The Loginski, what are you doing? You are supposed to be part of the fleet. Uh, my my planes completely whiffed. They didn't hit anything. The New Zealands appear to have retired. They've slowed down and are out of the battle for the most part. Um, if any of the planes, yeah, these guys are back. I can't believe they completely whiffed. Normally they do pretty well. Landing at dusk. That means we're gonna start losing the light soon. Leginski, what are you doing? Do I did I lose control of the Leginski too? Rudder jam to port. There you go. All right, there's another ten approaching enemy ships. Benbow just hit by three, twelve inch guns from the disabled. Um, who's it? Uh, Leginski. Oh, he's not jammed anymore. The Ben, I mean, I'm not getting, I'm not getting a lot of jollies out of hitting the Benbows though, because they're pretty weak. Enemy ship diadem hit with a torpedo. Oh, the, uh, the planes. Hey, there we go. They got a hit on an enemy heavy cruiser. I mean, I was hoping you'd go for the battle cruisers, but you know, whatever you do you. Benbow hit a couple more times. Is it two different ones or the same one? Different ones. They only got 10 inch guns. They're not really terribly terrifying, but I mean, it's equivalent of sinking a, uh, a heavy cruiser. So Anson took a hit. Benbow took another one. Heavy damage. Five knots. All right, Zate, you need to get to the other side of the engagement. Loginski, you chase down the uh, these things over here. You need to turn up this way, and get away from here. Uh, do we got any planes left? No.
Oh, shit. I didn't realize there was an enemy. Doodle so close. All right, you need to refocus your fire. Oh, you already did. On the enemy battle. Oh, shit. Ugh. Enemy battle cruisers. 20 knots light damaged. All right, they're still damaged. They're still damaged. I don't know what that is. That's probably a Benbo. Leginsky's running out of ammo. Air hit. Oh, shit. Air just took a absolute pounding. Lost her rudder and a turret, but at least she's jammed center. Which means I can keep going straight and still try to cut them off. Although they're not hitting them! We're not scoring hits! Still not scoring hits! Other people are hitting other things, but we're not hitting who we're supposed to be hitting. Oh, they turned away. Oh, thank God. They turned away. Oh, finally! Hit him in the booty! Zate's running out of ammo. New Zealand's hit again. It's it's always a pleasure when those guns with, with those ships always turn away from me. Alright. Let's turn north again. We gotta we gotta try to um get back together. We got we got them kind of penned in right here. Oh shit. Oh no, the sun's coming down. No. I mean I think we sank to the two ships maybe nothing nothing crazy though heavy damage to one of the New Zealands Leginsky cannot take a New Zealand unless she really starts landing some hits although there we go Starting to land some hits. Uh, do I got any destroyers? I do. I got a small flotilla here. Let's let's close. Let's see if we can get in there and close the distance. New Zealand hit. New Zealand hit. Thankfully, uh, Malik Helvot. Thanks for the diddly. Hopefully, my 12 inch. Oh, we destroyed a turret. Nice. My 12 inch guns are capable of. Oh, this is like close range shooting. We're definitely capable. And if we're lucky, did Leginsky slow down? 46% damage, 22%. Yeah, keep just, if we keep hammering them at this close range, maybe we'll get lucky and take out all their turrets. This guy's only got one operational turret left. Running out of ammo though. Oh, Zate just got plastered as soon as he turned away. 39% damage. Zate just lost two turrets in one hit. Yep. And he's slowed down. Time to completely disengage from that battle. And send in the destroyers. New Zealand hit. New Zealand hit. These New Zealand class ships are... Brutal. Oh, and poor Leginsky is, is uh, slowed down to 15 knots, too. Uh, I don't think I can launch any more planes. Well, technically, I think I could, but I don't know if they hit anything. Go. I don't care if you... I don't care if you die. Oh, Leginsky. Nice one. Three hits. Get him to turn away. Well, the knight will be here soon. Which... And one... One is approaching an enemy ship. Hopefully they're coming this way. I don't know where they are, though. 
I mean, I launched from right there, and I told him to come over here, so... Who? I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. No way. No way. Ah, oh, no way. <laughs> Out of arc my fine Polish ass. Okay, we, 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 we can do this. Fire everything. Before the sun goes down. Oh, no, I don't, I don't think so. I don't, I don't think so. Oh, there's the planes. I don't think they hit anything, now. Time to retire. The sun has gone down. Oh no. What wait, what did you find? What did you find? Oh, it's just an enemy destroyer. Armed a merchant cruiser my ass. I don't know what that is, but it ain't no armed merchant cruiser. I just put I just put two per torpedoes into it, but I don't know what it was. I think we got the leg up on that. I think we got. Hey, Elysium! Good to see you, bud. Sorry, I was really focused on what was going on. I didn't see you and your people come on in. Caught the caught the tail end of me kicking the snot out of the. Well, I don't know if you could count it kicking the snot. Whoa! Uh, uh oh. We stumbled across an enemy ship in the dark. Do you have any torpedoes left? Nope. We don't, no, you know, don't, 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 don't. I don't have any torpedoes left. I do not have any torpedoes. We'll just go back to Finland. Oh, my, my torpedo bombers actually found someone. Nine of my, none of my torpedo bombers are approaching an enemy ship. So now we just wait to see if we get any strikes. Nope. Oh, we got one. Unships, unsighted ship hit by torpedo. In the middle of the night. Two! Three! Wow. So, I launched, what, four torpedo strikes during the daytime. And they got one hit. In the middle of the night, they managed to pull that out of their butt. They managed to pull out, what was that, four strikes? In the middle of the night? Against ships I didn't even know where they were? Alright, go home. Go home. We didn't, I don't think we lost anything... High, bigger than a destroyer, maybe. Can you get your own ships? Yes. I have friendly fired myself with torpedoes before. It is it is definitely something that I have done. Okay, let's see what the after action report says. A patrol boat. Wait. Oh God. That's patrol boat number 30 hit a mine. I thought that was saying a patrol boat hit 30 mines. <laughs> After the first 29, you'd think you'd learn. So I lost, the only ship I lost was um, that Corvette. And we did sink one of the, we sank one New Zealand class battle cruiser. And unfortunately, both Benbows and the Anson both managed to get away from the battle, but we did sink one of their battle cruisers. Most likely with those torpedoes right at the end. But I will take a victory. 10,000 points up on the British. Huzzah! Oh god, I'm happy with that. Oh, and if Totem Wolf, if you're still around, this is the ship that I designed and is named in your honor. Binks, did I just hear you? Binks. Hey, buddy. I knew I heard your little fat pitter patter. Oh, it's the big cat. It's the big cat. Shit, chips. Oh, yeah, I do need to set some chips to rating. He wants food. I don't know if you can hear him, but he's snorting. Hey, bud, bud. 
I'm scratching his butt, so now he's... Oh, he's going nuts. I'm scratching his butt, and he's going nuts. I want the ability to construct ram bow... Ow, he's licking my face on my ship so I can put them on aircraft carriers and hand deliver air... Ah! He's licking my face. Um, you can ram enemy ships, but unfortunately, ram bows are just not a thing. Came in right before it decided... Oh, cool. Oh, God! He's looking at my face. He's trying to put his tongue in my mouth. All right, now I got cat slive all over me. This is fine. Oh, only two more months left on our heavy cruiser here, the Silent Dragon, too. Cat wants to eat my face. Yes, he does. Uh, let's take a look at the Almanac. Wow! Look at Great Britain's naval budget. 550,000. All right, so they've got... So the British have four battleships in service. But we saw three of them. Two were Benbows, and one was the Anson. The Benbows were nothing. They have five battle cruisers, though. We sank one. And no carriers, but they do have six light carriers. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Um, it might be time to design a purpose-built carrier. Ow. Enemy submarine torpedoed and sunk one of our light cruisers. Destroyer hit a mine and was destroyed. Oh, oh, another fleet battle! Hot diggity daffodil. Let's see what we got. Um, that's one big. We got two cruiser, two battle cruisers, and a battleship. New aircraft carrier. Okay, so this is just a gun battle. This is just a gun battle. Cruisers raid. I, I might not even bother putting my cruisers on raid anymore. It doesn't seem. I don't have enough of them, I don't think, to make much of a difference, especially with every... Whoa! Enemy ship sighted. Oh, shiza. Alright. Battle cruisers. Do your thing. Well, we do have, um... Ships taken off still. Okay. Worker. AI control. Core part. Fall in behind the Luginski. Don't fuck it up this time. Oh, shit. Enemy battle cruise. If that's... You know what? You know what? If that's that... If that's that other battle... If that's that other, like, New Zealand-class doodle, the Luginski's getting eaten alive right now. Nope, it's the lion, and it, it's already ri ripping me to shreds. It's basically the same thing. With slightly more armor. Okay, got it. We've, oh god, we've already gotten hit multiple times. Already taken two 16-inch hits. Hit her with a 6-inch gun? You can't do any better than that? You have to hit her with the 12-inch guns. Alright. Okay, there's more ships up here. I don't know what they are. Oh god, there's more ships up there. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, keep going south, and if I need to, I can retreat to Riga. Okay, this is fine. Shiza. Okay, okay, we're starting to hit the lion. Looks like it's focusing on the destroyers coming at its face. All right. Lead ship, fire torpedoes. 4,500 yards. Out of arc, my fine butt. If we get them to turn away, they won't be able to fire their guns at me. Another 10 inch, or uh, another 12 inch hit. Medium damage registered. And we got another Diadem class up here. Zate just uh, landed a couple hits with the secondary battery. What do we got up here? We got another Anson. I'm not, well, no, the Anson was the slightly better one. 14 inch guns. You, uh, squad max. I'm gonna put you on screen for this bad boy up here. You should be firing at the Anson if possible. You are. Okay, there we go. Lions taking a couple more hits. We need it. We need to do some serious damage though. We need to start taking those guns out. How long until the, the sun just went up? Eight hours. I'm a little bummed that we're not hitting because we've got high quality guns and the, oh god, three hits and below the waterline. Um, we have the best fire control directors known to man. 
Okay, two more hits. Three more hits. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, right. No hits on the Anson yet. Another hit on the Leginski in the engine room. Trading six inch hits for 16 inch hits. Turret disabled. And unfortunately, they're, oh, there we go. Hit on the Anson finally, that's over here. I've got 24 guns firing to their nine and we're just not doing it. Not getting any hits in. Oh shit. Wait, no. Only one of those was a big one. It's like four hits. Wait, only one of them counted. So only, well, she slowed. That was a devastating hit right there. 52% damage. Wait, what? Why is it not registered as 50? It says 52%. Right here, it says that's not 52%. Eight hits. Oh, okay, we gotta pull away. Can't get it. Anson's getting it pretty good right now, though. They're just out. The British always seem to outgun me. British are excellent gunners. You're firing your your torpedoes at the enemy destroyers. You're firing all your torpedoes at the enemy destroyers. Oh my god. That's just brilliant. Fucking battle cruiser right there. These guys just fired so many shots. That was so many torpedoes. All right, let's bring in the light cruisers. See if they can help shield us. Why are you firing all your torpedoes at the enemy to destroyers? Oh, you're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. Trying to keep the get the light cruisers to um, shield them. Leginski's down to 13 knots, which means she's taken some pretty heavy damage. It's not registering on the screen though. I have to turn north. Gotta get away. You're all failures. I don't care about you. The lion is leaving. She's being chased off by light cruisers with five inch guns. Fire, you can tell them to not fire automatically. I wish I could tell them to just, I'm not exactly sure. Um, I wish I could just tell them to uh, fire at primary, you know, capital ships, but they, they won't do that. How are your, how are these gunners so bad? Enemy air, enemy aircraft. I do have a heavy cruiser over here apparently too. A bomb hit. They got dive bombers. Yeah, fighting the British again. And God damn it. They're, they can hit with 16 inch guns easier than I can hit with five inch guns. I'm supposed to be good at this. A little frustrating. Worker hit in the X turret and it's been destroyed. My gunners are awful, just awful. I'm really quite disappointed with them. They're just terrible. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, 
All of his turrets are all of his turrets are destroyed. All of them. My gutters are god awful. Just terrible. This guy's still fine though. He hasn't taken a hit yet. Just awful, awful. Airships are dropping bombs. Wait, a blimp just hit a Corvette with a bomb? Wait, t okay, I've got 10. I don't know who they're going after. Those are ground based. Nothing. Are you even shooting? I'm so disappointed. My gutters are just terrible. 24 guns to nine and nothing. Some of the, a lot of these ships are even designed to just put out a higher weight of fire at higher accuracy than the enemy. Nothing. Hey, there we go. How many hits have you landed? Six. That heavy cruiser got plastered. That poor bastard. Oh, these are destroyers that just got managed to get through the uh, fusillade of enemy fire. He's even going in a straight line. Come on, guys. Glad to hit. Commissar, yeah, okay, this is too hot. Uh, commissars on every turret is the right idea. There's a hit. Light damage, 15 inch shells. Oh, finally landed a couple of hits. I don't think they did anything now. Knowing my luck, they over penetrated and didn't do anything. 50% ammo remaining. Who's we got up here? That's probably like an enemy. I, I bet. I bet this is a big boy right up here. I bet those aren't little men. Destroyer hit with something. Like even their light cruisers are landing hits. We had this problem before. Last time we fought the British, couldn't hit the broadside of a barn. Who are you? That's just a destroyer. Come on! I don't think I've sunk any, I don't even think I've sunk a destroyer yet. This is sad. How bad is your crew? Front four guns are out of ammo. Its secondary batteries can't even land a hit. I think that was a, I think that was a hit. No, well, again, no damage, no damage recorded. This is one of the most pathetic battles I've fought. Had every advantage, nothing, and the Anson just hit me and disabled the turret. She's still out there. Are you firing on her? Yes. Come on. Come on, the French just blew up when I showed up. They just they, they didn't even try to fight. Well, I got two of my eight guns firing. Oh, there we go. There's a hit. But there is the the lion. No. Not worth it. It's time to go. Sad and pathetic. Oh, do we actually hit or run into someone? Uh, oh, come on. Come on. 
Glory! Glory shall be mine! You missed. That was a station. No, I'm okay. That's fine. No, this is fine. Stationary Shameful target. Display. Shameful display! Missed a stationary target. This is fine. I took a lot of damage and I lost a lot of destroyers and I didn't do anything. Not nearly as good as the last battle. Well, I guess you can hang out there. Six destroyers. Heavy damage to one battleship, destroy was well, sunk one destroyer. Is that in terms of damage output, it was actually pretty even. It wasn't as devastated as I thought. That was pretty even. He's god damn it. Whenever I build heavy cruisers, they're always just such I always think the designs are great, and then they just turn into crap. Hey, an, oh, I don't even know when the last time I built a sub was, but it sank a British Corvette. We lost a destroyer. Cruiser battle. Uh, except, Let's see what this is. What do we got? Carriers and the two battle cruisers. Oh no, drizzle. Well, Drizzle won't prevent me from flying. Okay. Oh, no. Drizzle will prevent me from flying. Shit. All right, guys. It's drizzling. That means the planes are not going to do anything. I was like, hey, at least I got an advantage in air power. Nope. Yep. Midski, you're good. Oh, God damn it. Point blank range, 16 inch guns. Yup, yup, I was worried about that. Okay, alright, we are about who are about to die, salute you. Midski, engines disabled. First hit. First hit! Engines disabled. Midski's still firing, though. This thing just ate three hits. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We can do this, we can do this, we can do this. We can do this! Cross the T. Fire torpedoes. Fire, I wish I could aim these personally. Feel like I'd be good at that. Okay, that was one hit. Two hits. We got one, we got one barrage left. Get out of there. Get out of there. Do it for Midge. Oh, two more hits. Oh, we just put what, four torpedoes into the New Zealand. Oh my God. Uh, okay. I hate this ship, I hate this ship, I hate this ship. I fought it like three times already, I hate this ship. You. I want to personally control you. Do it for Midge! Do it for Midge! He got shot right in the pooper! How is that? How, mu how much speed has this thing still got? Oh, that thing just went down. It's still heavy damage, still making 15 knots. Can't go after it. No way I can go after it. Although it looks like it may have slowed down. Five knots. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go after it. Are, did you, is your rudder jammed? What's wrong with you? He must have misunderstood signals or something because I can't. 
Yes, your signal was to piss off. Oh, he looks like he's stopped. How bad did you misunderstand that signal? Please tell me I can lock. Damn it! It's just a drizzle. I don't care if you have, you know, issues getting home. Torpedo her. Torpedo her. Brody. 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 Leave, leave no, no, leave no man alive. New Zealand hit by torpedoes. New Zealand hit by torpedoes. I think I got it. I think there was a dud in there too. Point blank range, 800 yards. If you, if any of these miss, you're fired. Straight to the gulag. If, if a single torpedo misses. Got it. It won't die. All right, Z. We've avenged Midge. Midge's poor, broken butt. Right in the engine. Did you fix that? Oh, no. He's okay. All right. We put, like, nine torpedoes into that thing. You know what? Um, I don't trust this game. Zayt. It's still moving. Nope. Nope. It's dead. It's dead. Oh, the New Zealand is dead. The lo Oh! Oh! Now the weather clears. Did <laughs> the planes just launched. Now the weather clears. Okay. That's that battle battlecruiser's down. Woo! No, Mitch is still okay. Enemy oh, God. There are enemy aircraft out here. Flee. Flee for my life. We got, we got to get out of here and make sure no... Okay. Woo! Okay. We lost one destroyer. We sank a battlecruiser. Uh, they still have the lion, we know that, but I mean, most of the British um, tonnage is in battle cruisers. Their battleships are nothing. Take advantage of naval weakness and northern Asian British troops invade in uh, our possession in Kaichou Bay. Spy has been caught in the U.S. Not my problem. New medium bombers are in service. Convoy, we don't have anything. Oh wait. Estimated enemy forces to battle cruiser. Did we we transferred ships over here? Where where are they? Where are they? Oh, that's Northeast Asia. Well, you know what? Uh, we got to transfer ships up that way. Uh, and you and you know what? I'm you know this is what we're gonna do. Where are those ships? Where are those ships? You too. Uh, Southeast Asia. Southeast Asia. How about a couple? Send a couple destroyers out there too. One, two, three, four. Move ships. Not going to let me do that all in one go. Why won't it let me? Northeast Asia. Go. Move ship. Northeast Asia. Let's do this. Let's do this. Blockade. Torpedo the Kopshalov. Battleship engagement. We got there in time, for the love of God. We've got the Glav Tar Tar Tar, and we got the Maxim Vince. And we do have an airbase here. I don't know what it's going to be doing. Here, you, for the love of God, fall in behind the Glav Tar Tar Tar. And you guys are just going to scout for me. Oh. Hey, buddy. What are you doing over here? We got a battle cruiser. It's a battle cruiser on battle cruiser. The Indomitable. What is she armed with? She outguns us by a lot. She's also 10,000 tons heavier. The British battle cruisers put mine to shame. And mine are really more for taking out. Okay, uh, squad max, turn away. Oh, wait, we got... We, we landed the first hit, though. We got... Can, can my fighters strafe it or something? 
Wait, wait, are they actually doing that? Are they strafing it? <laughs> and my heavy cruiser landed a hit. Glavatar Tartar hit, turret disabled. Woo! They actually hit it with a bomb. Would you look at that? Oh, did, did you just slow down? No, why are you going so slow? Looks like you're going really slow, doesn't it? Okay, all right. Um, my cruiser, please tell me you have a torpedo, just one torpedo on you. One torpedo? Okay, we got a pair of torpedoes. We're, I mean, we have hit her several times, but those are 16 inch guns. Start uh, nosing. Oh, God damn it. Critical hit. Two turrets destroyed. What are... The turrets on these things are made out of paper. Apparently. Just try to pepper her with small guns and see what happens. Turret disabled. All of my turrets are destroyed for the love of God. She turned away. Oh, 20 torpedo bombers are approaching. 20. I swear to God if you don't hit this thing. One hit, two hits, three hits, four hits, five hits, six. Oh. That's why you don't send capital ships to the Far East alone. Seven. Eight. Light Cruiser hit a mine and sank. Oh, Torpedo Bombers did it. The Torpedo Bombers saved my ass. The Battle of Zing Tao. Well, that actually went pretty well. Uh, us getting disputed border areas. Yes. Peace lar with our side getting large territories and considerable reparations. That's a hell of a list. Oh, I want Ireland. I only, well, I only get four points. South Africa is worth 25. I don't even know if that's possible. Wait, oh, Corsica is Russia? Yeah, I took it from the Frenchies. All right, all right. Um... Newfoundland, Borneo, uh, all right, all right, Dalmatia, more Mediterranean possessions, Nigeria, eh, um, I'm liking Borneo, I think I'll take Borneo. Okay, guns, I'm gonna need those. All right. Russia's taken a fair few territories, um, Got some uh, Chinese territories, Vietnam, Borneo, Corsica. Uh, I stole some East and West Africa from the Germans. Uh, also, I, I, I've got Russian um, uh, uh, Caribbean provinces war as well. What is this? This is uh, Rule the Waves 2. You design, build, and fight ships because ships are fun to fight with. Uh, but I do have not enough ships on foreign station. Foreign station, foreign station, foreign station, foreign station. There we go. Okay. Yeah, it was me. It was Austria. And, well, I went to war with Austria, and then one month later, the British were like, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, the fun part of the game is designing the ships because it's very, very in depth. Uh, like currently, I have a, a, a set of new battle cruisers under construction. I open the design. Yeah, so this is the design you work with. This is the, the the interface you work with when you're designing ships. You pick the guns, you pick the armor, you pick the uh, the engines, all that fun stuff. Oh yeah, and there's the and um, aircraft carriers and stuff too. 
all that fun stuff. Uh, I need to I need to take one more bio break before we're done today because I drank a lot of tea. Ah, only thirty minutes left, but I'm not gonna make it. Hey, we're back. Alrighty then. Um, I think we need to design new destroyers too. Now that I think about it, we had a couple technologies pop up. Your mother's a bitch. Your mother's a bitch. I love that one. Alrighty, uh, new destroyers. We do we. I know we have super firing turrets on the destroyers, but uh, double mounts have not been researched, so we'll reduce the amount of guns to singles. I'll keep them on as fi uh, quality one five inch guns. Third, I do need more speed out of these because the last run of destroyers couldn't overtake the British cruisers, which was a problem. Uh, let's see here. Um, let's put on a pair of dual purpose secondary uh, three inch guns. Uh, make sure it's got, well, we can put mines on these bad boys, mine sweeping gear, increased depth, starred storage, K-guns. Can I put more K-guns on? Put four K-guns. Uh, we're basically going to rip off most of the AA guns. Here, let's do two, set, two three-inchers. That'll free up a little bit of room for a couple AA guns. <laughs> Midge, you... You filthy, filthy man. Uh, let's see. Add on a, another center line swivel mount. And I'll have to take off a knot. So that's 33 knots. That's still faster than the British. And if I, I if I can, um, no, I'll keep the engine set to speed. Is this, uh, and then um, I'll give them a couple more rounds. Is this legal? I basically don't have room for AA guns. There's too much shit on the deck. <laughs> Dual purpose, thank you. Oh, I, uh, I, I don't know why my mind would go We love there. you. Shut up, baby, I know Ooh. it. Thanks, Midgley. Uh, let's see. You know what's great, Midge? You're getting all lewd, and I have exactly 69 viewers right now. Hey -oh. Carry a meta meta arrived yet? No, I the um I've got my tech uh, tech rate set to 60%, so everything's progressing 40% more slowly than it would have. So it's 1934 right now. We barely have light aircraft carriers with like 30 planes on them, maybe. Which reminds me, we need to design a new aircraft carrier too, or maybe build some more of the uh, the other ones. Uh, save that design. And let's lay down 10 new destroyers. Battle cruisers right now are taking up the majority of my budget, uh, but they're armed with 17 inch guns, so they could definitely outshoot anything on the diddly. International Peace Conference suggested outlawing submarines! Absolutely. The wanted sinking of ships by submarines in modern warfare is nothing less than barbaric. All major nations agree to outlaw the constructions and operations of subs for eight years. All existing submarines are scrapped. <laughs> I hate subs so much. That's beautiful. Oh, no. We had to scrap five submarines that were built in the early 1900s. Internal belts improve uh, quality of armor. That is beautiful. Oh, you know what I should do, though? Um, sh shoot. I gotta pull these guys home. Uh, move these guys back to Europe. All major ships go into the reserve fleet to save money. Uh, Kope Shalov needs to return home, too. And these two bad boys need improved fire controls uh, computers. Nothing else. I'm not going to change anything else on these ships. Everything else on them is perfectly fine. Oh, wait. Can I change the quality of the guns? I can. I can improve the quality of their dual purpose guns. It'll only take four months. It's pricey, but it only takes four months, so we're good.
Hey -o! Just your production soaring as new methods and technologies are introduced. New French, uh, French, French, uh, seaplane tender, which I have not built any yet, but I don't have catapults. Reduced engine HP requirements. Delightful. Enables five inch dual purpose mounts. Torpedo protection three. Beautiful. New ships will have better torpedo protection. All right, Comrade Air, done. LMH6, done. Doom! Okay. Um, as soon as these are done, no, we can design it right now. I need a new class. Bin select dual purpose. Oh, um, let's take a look. I mean, even if, if I didn't, it's not the big, it's not a big deal. No, I did. Comrade, no, that's Zate. My bad. Hang on, hang on. Ah, uh, no, I did not. Um, so if I if I just wanted to change that, it's not a big deal. Okay. Not the end of the world. Fix that real quick. Sorry, that was my bad. One of our cruises run aground on the shore of a minor nation while performing an illicit operation. Definitely their fault. Man, the British and the Austrians are just pissy. New Japanese float plane. A pretty low top speed. Counterintelligence believe Austria-Hungary's stolen technology. Tell them to go screw. I would love to fight AH toe-to-toe -to -toe without the British at their back. All right, there we go. Oh, another round of fighting is broken out in the Balkans. Austria-Hungary did it. Diesel engines. A little late for that, but I'll take it. There. Ooh, perfect. Our ba our monthly balance just went through the roof because the Totem Wolf Shalov has been completed. Oh, that's a that's a sexy, sexy ship. Just goes from war to war. Of course. Of course. 30 knot top speed. 17 inch guns. 25 inch guns and 10 double turrets, 24 dual purpose three inch guns, and a very, very hefty for the time doodle. Love it. Uh, the MIG Design Bureau has designed a new dive bomber. Yes, bring it on. The MIG 31. What's, what the hell is long is this going to take? One more month. Anti-British rebellion is broken out of the Falklands. Uprising in Africa. Send send the totem wolf. Eliminates rate of fire reliability penalty for quad turrets? I don't even have quad turrets. Oh, shit! Okay. Uh, all right. No, this is fine. All right, no, 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 this is fine, this is fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, didn't I just say I wanted to go toe-to-toe -to -toe, uh, toe -to -toe with Austria-Hungary without the British getting involved? Okay, Zate. The entire Zate-class ships, the Apple-class ships. Um, actually, no. I'm gonna send the big... Mm -mm. I'm gonna send all the battle cruisers. Um, two heavy cruisers... The carriers, four light cruisers, and eight destroyers to the Mediterranean. Boom. Uh, maybe while we're here, prove the bases on Corsica. I already got airfields there. Oh shit, do those airfields have planes on them though? They do. Okay. Woo! <laughs> Set up lights to raid. Well, I won that last war without any uh, lights raiding, didn't we? Um, these are all on foreign service. So I got at least these two. We do need a new... Because, um, I mean, even our new class of light cruisers are out of date, unfortunately. Oh, trade production. Hey, 
And you know, this works to my benefit because all the world's submarines have been scrapped. The Sukhoi Design Bureau has de developed a new torpedo bomber. All right, the last ones have been pretty good. I've got 160 of them in uh, in Hoosits right now. This new one is faster, has a shorter operational range, has less firepower, is less mechanically reliable, and is only slightly tougher. Again, nope. I'm going to go ahead and hard pass on that. Ooh, here we go. Cruiser. Oh, ho, 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 ho. yes. Let's do this. Uh, suppress enemy airfields, please. KE refer to uh, Corvettes. Oh, it's night, and all oh balls. All I've got is a light cruiser. It's the I was expecting, but oh shit! I've got the Scanlan here. Shoot her. Uh, okay. I really wish it would work correctly. I don't know why it doesn't. I mean, we just blasted the hell out of this thing. How many hits did they already land? 13 plus 2? Yeah, it's stuck on fast. Can, uh, can you fire a torpedo with this bad boy? Doesn't look like he's going too fast, so... Wow, that was a lot of misses, but we did get a hit in, so. Wait, spots unknown ship? Is there another one out here? I really thought we would have a chance to do some, uh... I think he's dead. Medium damage, that's it? Really? Right? Put another torpedo into him. Out of arc. Oh, it might be on the other side. Oh, yep, there we go. Two torpedo. Yeah, he's dead. Back to Corsica. For fear spreads variety of shock. It gets bet. Oh, was there another ship out there? It gets better when you have um, more torpedoes. Because you could definitely get a lot more than I've got. Oh, Shiza. Uh oh. I've oh and we oh Canadian, please tell oh no I don't have control of the Canadian. Uh oh. Oh god I don't have control of any of these guys. Although those uh, okay okay no this is fine we're okay. Just go kill the Panther. It was just destroyers. We just stumbled on a bunch of destroyers. It's fine it's fine everything's fine. Oh, shit. Oh, that's just a patrol boat. Just a Corvette. Everything's perfectly all right now. Oh, We're fine. fine. We're all fine here. It's okay. No, it's you. fine. It's fine. We're actually okay. Sun's coming up. Turn around. Find someone else to kill. So far, so good. You're not a... You don't get to be a real Russian until you bring home three Austrian scalps. Who's in here? It's just a bunch of light of our light cruisers that we sent over. Oh no! They've got planes! Right! I forgot about that. We should we should increase the size of our air bases and add fighters. This is this is their home territory. I definitely shouldn't stay here. D oh oh wait. Aircraft damage. I didn't see any hits. I've only got, what, 40 or 60 airplanes or something like that? I think 40 airplanes in the Mediterranean. Uh, 60 more if you count my heavy damage to a destroyer, sank a, uh, a cruiser, a destroyer, and a corvette. Minor victory. That was a, that was a fun little engagement. Uh, we were. Wait, is the last one done? 
They've both fallen off the doodles. Okay, we've got both totem wolves done. Good. Well, I'm not setting all the lights to raid. I like having them uh, uh, combat. I'll set some of them to raid. Like, let's take two of them. And set them to raid. Just to get a couple out. Yep, they got a couple. No submarines. We're pretty safe. Uh, we were talking about really quickly uh, designing uh, our next level of battle diddlies. And I think I'm going to stick with 15 inch guns. Basically something to complement the, the apples. And I'm not going to build it straight off of the apples because those designs are a little old. Yeah, the top battleships are in Asia, I know. I meant to bring them home, but I, uh, uh, you can't, for some reason, you can't move from multiple areas to one area. I don't know why. All right, um, so ideally what we want to do is at least give this bad boy a 3223 configuration of 15-inch guns. That will give him fire superiority over the apple classes that we had before. Uh, maximum is 46,000 tons. 29 knots is way more than we need, or look at it more like 25 or 26 knots in terms of its speed. Next month unlocks 17 inch guns at the quality one. Yeah, I know, right? Um, okay, torpedo protection three. We can uh, all of our all of our secondary and tertiary guns can be dual purposed now. 24 5-inch guns is pretty upset, uh, uh, obsessive. I'm going to put an 18. I'm going to put... I am going to max out the number of tertiary guns. These are really, really good against enemy aircraft. Uh, AA directors, three. Uh, let's let's split the difference here. Let's let's make sure we get a little bit of, of medium and light AA2 in there. I have to cut down this by a lot. Down to like a dozen. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, alrighty. Fire control positions up. Improved director. 45,000 tons. Speed of 26 knots. The uh, incline belt and a magazine box. Well, a magazine box saves me a lot of weight. Oh, you know what it could do? Alright, hear me out here. What if we designed this class to operate only in home waters? If we knocked the range down to short, we would save 1,400 tons in oil bunkers. And what we could do is we could keep these in the home waters. They would not be able to leave Northern Europe during a war. But if I, I can strategically move them outside of a war... Or I get during what I'm thinking is that the battle cruisers go out and like do a lot of the work, uh, and the heirs, the comrade apples, that is, can can accompany them. These ones would stay in the home waters. Do you have newer engines? No, I don't. Whenever you build a new design, it automatically gives you the best technology. Um, that means we could put several additional inches of armor on this. Five inches on the deck. Wow. What's a gun day to look like? Look at the immunity zone on this bad boy. From 15,000 yards to 24,000 yards, it has immunity against its own high-quality guns. Um, let's give the extended belt an inch and the extended deck an inch. Let's put this down to 14 inches, and let's give it 25 knots. Secondaries need to go up to 2. That prevents splintering. Can I get that inch back? I can. And I can give him 5 additional rounds of ammunition per gun. Can add an extra gun. Oh, I don't, I don't need... It's got enough guns. It's got 10 15 inch guns, which is more than the last ship of its, uh, the, the ba last battleship we had, um, had. It also has way more armor. 
It's got a huge immunity zone. All right. That's a design. Bam, right there. Done. And it's going to be named... What are the fucking odds? What are the goddamn odds, Midge? Wait, I can tell you what the odds are. The queue is full. It was 75 to 1. Got me to start watching the streams live. There's an old caveman that hates seemingly magic talking pictures. Well. Oh, shit. I hit the wrong button. The glitter hoof class. Alrighty. Save it. Yes, I know it has a short range. It's designed to have a short range. The rebellion in the Falkland continues. Oh, those destroyers are done. Enemies sounded out about negotiated peace with us getting disputed or areas and some colonies. No! No! Keep hitting them. I want I want to. Uh, suppress enemy airfields, attack enemy ships near the objective, suppress enemy airfields. I want to ki wait, what? Get, come on! I've got my, my new class of battle cruisers here, give, give access now! Do we just- Oh, mother bitcher. Stumbled across an entire enemy uh, fleet in the middle of the night. I don't have anything. Alright, I guess we'll just pitter-patter around and see if we accident upon someone. Whoop, I just saw an enemy unknown diddly diddled. Oh, it's a land target. Uh... This is the lamest battle ever. Oh shit! Something's there. It's a transport. Shoot. Oh no! Why? Save those! There's an enemy battleship out here somewhere. We saw him once. Uh oh. Is uh, avoiding torpedoes. So why can they uh, uh, launch their torpedoes if I can't torpedo? Shoot her! They're baddies. We know the baddies. You are. You could spit on them from the deck. Shut up! I'm sorry, what? Okay, exactly how far away are those ships that I wasn't even aware that were there? Oh, balls. Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine. Fire your torpedoes. At, and just, just leave. High speed, wait, flooding? Oh, I got hit by a torpedo? I don't even see that. Well. Now you have to wait. Wait, high speed, 14 knots? Okay, this is fine. 
Wow, that was a... Oh, I thought he was going to hit him there. How bad you're flooding? Yeah, it could be worse. Could be worse. And some re reading glasses for those lookouts. Tell me about it. Well, it was like, there was like four enemy destroyers like maneuvering about. I think there may have been a heavy cruiser in there. And then all of a sudden there was just three ships like 40 yards away. Just in the, just out of, out of the darkness. There they were. <laughs> to the gulags, exactly. I said, I've sent a lot of people to the gulags. At least I like to think so. Don't sink, don't sink, don't sink, don't sink. Flooding's basically under control. Don't get, don't get bombed. She's okay. Heavy damage to a light cruiser, so it was not a heavy cruiser. But we are, with, with that lame little battle, we are out of time for the day. It is 6 o'clock here, which is my normal scheduled stop time. Uh, but we will be continuing this tomorrow. Same place, same time, right here on Twitch. 2 p.m. Eastern, our Soviet Union playthrough. Glorious Soviet Union playthrough of Rule the Waves 2 which has been pretty fun so far. I'm going to be really sad if this war ends before we put a 17-inch shell into somebody, preferably an Austrian, because usually their ships are crap anyway. But anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. I do appreciate it. As always, the stream schedule is posted in Discord. There's the link up there, and it's over in chat. Um, I update the, the stream schedule every Sunday, so you will always know what is coming when. Like I said, tomorrow we're going to be continuing this. And yeah. Tomorrow's Wednesday, so this and then Thursday is my day off. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye Wait, we gotta end with this. The next time I gotta remember to tip the box. And the national